Hello and welcome to the Gallant Goblin plays Blood on the Clock Tower. <laughs> Today we're celebrating Earth Day. How's everybody doing tonight? Allergies. Why are you okay? <laughs> and Catboy dies upstream. <laughs> <laughs> no. I was, was going to say like, allergies. Yeah. Yeah. All that spread the that was me just choking on my spit. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay. Well, for Earth Day today, uh, I am. I I thought I would take this opportunity to pay fealty to our new uh, overlords of the Earth. Uh, all of the AI machines that will soon be taking over over all our jobs and everything we do. Uh, and so I'll tell you a little bit more about that as we go through. But let me introduce our players first of all. We're going to start. Oh, I don't have something special I need each of you all to do when I call out your name this time. I just need you all to give me one random word each when I call out your names for your intros. You are also welcome to plug your streams or whatever. Uh, but I need one random word each from you as I call you out. We're going to start this week with uh, writings. Okay. Um, my random word X, uh, will be retro. Okay. Uh, yeah, writings hit, uh, you can follow along on my shenanigans of hit list video. Uh, I do streaming on YouTube, Twitch, all that stuff. Talk indie film content there as well. Um, yeah. Got some upcoming movies. Should be fun. Sweet. Hell's a... uh, Sausage be the random word. And, um, I'm... Helza, I'm Helza at home on YouTube, and uh, you might see my cat muffin as well as we go along. Awesome. Morgan. Potatoes. Oh. And Maybe Beardy. Uh, defenestration. Okay. Uh, yeah. uh, you, you'll find me on uh, as Beardy Taz on YouTube or uh, Instagram. Until we toss you out a window. Ryan Terry. <laughs> A uh, random word is picnickers. Mm -hmm. and, uh, just because it's fun to say. Uh, yeah, you uh, can find me here uh, and anywhere these videos are shown. <laughs> Alex. <laughs> uh, primal is my word. Ooh. Ooh. That's a good choice. <laughs> Alex, you have a book coming out. I have I have a book that came out, Tian Sha World Guide. I'm an expert on dragons. Thank you in the world of uh, Tian Sha, and then the character guide is coming out too. So look out for that. So um, you can get you can grab your grubby hands on this world. So I'm very excited. The character guide I think is August, isn't it? I think we still have a ways. It's in August. Yeah. That's what I've heard. I'm looking forward to that one. That'll be the new shiny thing. But the world guide is gorgeous. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Art is so beautiful. Thank you. Hit me up on any of the dragons. One and fun fact: no one knows this yet, but one of the dragons is named after my mom. So oh. you have to guess which oh. one. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Guess. wait. That's that means she's a dragon lady. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and she's like a very cool story. No one tried to rob her of her treasure. Could she come after you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, reclaim that. Reclaim that like stereotype. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. And Jesse. <laughs> Hello, I had a word and I forgot it. I need a new word then. Pick one at random. <laughs> Robot. Perfect. <laughs> and Micah draws. Hi, uh, my random word is dragon. And uh, you, you can find me uh, at Micah Draws on Twitter, Instagram, pretty much all the socials. And also it's the last 18 hours of my Monster Man coloring book Kickstarter. Um, so it's your last chance to get one before mm -hmm. they go on normal sales in a month or so. <laughs> Sweet. They probably get at a cheaper price if you get on Kickstarter is my bet, right? Yep. That's yep. true. Exactly. Give us the name of it one more time so they can find it on Kickstarter. Uh, it's the Monster Men and Men of Urban Fantasy Coloring Book. Sweet. Ooh. And Marissa. Performance is going to be my random word. Um, and then you can find me on all the socials at Marissa Murray. Uh, mostly I am just doing background work here and for Paizo. Love it. Catboy. Hello, my name is Catboy. Um, my word is going to be kumquat. Ooh. And, <laughs> and um, <laughs> uh, I don't have anything personal to promote, but I'm seeing a lot of times in Twitch chat under KH Guides. Uh, he streams on Twitch, twitch.tv. 
makes guides for Kingdom Hearts, and I'm in his chat often as Legendary Mr. L. So please check him out because he's great. There you go. I don't mind the competition. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Glenn. <laughs> All right, my word is fireball. Yes. Oh, yeah. I'm just glad to be yes. here. Classic. And Pion. My word is honors. I bring ruin. <laughs> <laughs> honors, like honors college? That honors? Like otters. Oh, otters. Like, yeah, that's oh, what I heard. Otters. Otters. That's a good word. Okay. I heard otters. I feel you too. Word honors. Yeah. Okay. My hearing isn't the best. Uh, this week we're running a very special <laughs> script. Be kind, please lie by writings. That name sounds familiar. <laughs> writings. Tell us the story behind the script here, uh, and all the prizes this won, and uh, what the kind of theme behind it is. Okay, so this was a script for Nocturne Gaming. Uh, some people might know uh, the, the BOTC content that they do under Atreides. Um, they had a evil twin script competition that was, its climax was at Clock Tower Con this previous weekend in Washington, D.C. Uh, of the scripts that were submitted, uh, we came down to a final four at uh, D.C., which then the participants of that convention got to do live voting on the four scripts. And my script was the last script standing. I, so yeah, uh, became number one. Um, yeah, uh, strip, nice competition. I was, uh, I was, I'll admit, a little like complaint. I was like, oh my goodness, when I was, I learned that I had been the top uh, draw there. Uh, so yeah, be kind, please lie is a little bit nostalgic, hence the word retro for me, because that whole be kind, please rewind. Um, but this script also has a lot of characters that will probably lie because Fangu, Oho, uh, and other shenanigans where they don't want to die. So that's kind of where the lie comes from. Excellent. I'm looking forward to this one. Uh, so as part of me giving away some of my power to our new AI overlords for this game, uh, we're going to take advantage of the terrible writing that AI can sometimes do. And so... Um, some of our descriptions today are going to be terribly AI generated, and uh, we're going to just see if we can have a little fun with that. I've just uh, mm -hmm. asked it to base some descriptions based on only your names, so we'll see how this goes today. But first of all, I have a poem by uh, one chat GPT uh, in order to get us started today. Welcome to Goblinshire, a quirky enclave where kobold villagers as playful as otters thrive amidst lush potato fields and kumquat orchards. Here, retro <laughs> traditions mix with primal rituals, crafting a tapestry rich with the heritage of dragon tales and robotic inventions, all under the watchful eyes of picnickers who frequent the green to witness the theatrical performances of the local lore. But tonight, the air tingles with the scent of fireball sausages sizzling on open grills, a reminder not of festivities, but of foreboding. Whispers flutter that a demon has descended upon this peaceful hamlet, its arrival marked by sudden defenestration of the town's most beloved a dragon statue. This malevolent force hidden beneath a villager's guise threatens to disrupt the harmony with mischief and malice. As the last light fades, the villagers retreat from their culinary delights and jovial gatherings. Doors bolt and shutters close with the caution of those aware that in Goblinshire now, everyone has a reason to lie. With hearts heavy yet hopeful, they whisper good nights, knowing that survival in the night's enveloping darkness demands cunning and silence. Sleep well, Goblinshire. Keep your secrets close and your innocence closer. For the, as the moon rises, so too does the demon among you, shadowed or shrouded in the shadows of deceit. With that, we will pass out our tokens. Hopefully you get what you wanted. In this game, we should have seven townsfolk, two outsiders, two minions, and one solitary demon. And here you go. Take a look at that. And I am going to send you into the night. Sweet dreams, everybody. Good night. Welcome back, everybody. Let's take a look at our grimoire here. I haven't had a chance to really look through it just yet. Uh, 
Interesting. Okay. Uh, I think we've had Helza as our amnesia before. Maybe I'm misremembering. Um, but that's an awesome one for Helza. Our demon this time is Glenn, which should be very interesting. Oh, it's the combination of Glenn and Marissa, which is also very interesting with the Scarlet Woman. Oh, and Ryan Terry as the Poisoner. This is going to be a formidable evil team for our players. Hmm. Okay. We're going to have to see how this plays out. Uh, right next gets to be our balloonist, who's adding in a drunk, in case you were wondering about our... Um, oh yeah, this is going to be perfect. Yeah, uh, adding in a drunk. And I think, unfortunately for Catboy, I'm thinking about making Catboy here our drunk. Uh, is the drunk. Because my bluffs in this game are going to be the alchemist, the fortune teller, and the recluse. The washerwoman starts knowing that one or two players is a particular townsfolk. And I was thinking about just showing them Marissa and Ryan Terry as the alchemist and i thought that would be fun uh set the, setting them up for some success if they're quick off the draw and i think those two probably would be so that is my plan for now we will see how this goes but uh, if you have suggestions there in chat feel free to let me know oh i hit my night music there there we go all right, let us see what else uh, starting uh, information do we need. We have our Plague Doctor, we haven't seen that before. If you die, the Storyteller gains a not in play minion ability. Uh, so, yep, uh, I have a choice here uh, in this game. Probably the Goblin is gonna be what's gonna be passed out, but we'll see what happens in the time. Uh, what will happen is one of our existing minions will gain the Goblin ability if the Plague Doctor dies. Is most likely what we're gonna do here. Well, you know, we shall see. Uh, writing's our balloonist. Our amnesiac. In case you're wondering about our amnesiac ability, let me... Here, I think I can pull it up in our chat. If you ever want to see it in our chat down there, if you're watching live, you can type exclamation point amnesiac. If it's actually working, which I don't know if it is. Let's find out. There it is. Our amnesiac. Pick a number from 1 to 17. That is the number of townsfolk and outsiders we have on our script. Uh, for the corresponding character on the script, if in play, learn two players, one of whom is that character. If not in play, learn arbitrary information. So, for example, if uh, Helza picks the number, let's say, four for Balloonist, uh, in that case, they uh, she would learn writings and another person. And I think I have a sheet over here where I can keep track of that a little bit more quickly so i'm going to, have to fill that sheet out here uh when we finally get this game going and i have a minute to think but that is our amnesiac ability um it's kind of powerful i think um and it's not overly complicated to figure out but it's a little bit of a puzzle so that's the way i like my amnesiac abilities kind of powerful a little bit of a puzzle not not too frustrating i hope uh, I'm not going to tell Helza that the number is between 1 and 17. Helza's going to have to figure that out. So going to say, pick a number. And if they get a number that is not uh, in the range of what I'm looking for, then Helza's got to pick another one. Uh, we have our Gossip. We have our Gambler. We have our Poisoner. Our Sweetheart. If you're not sure about that one, when you die, one player is drunk from now on. We have our Fool and Jesse. Who's wearing the thing? Uh, we have ooh, Micah, our Cannibal, our Scarlet Woman, and our Oho. So, I think with all that said, let me check my first night information. Um, Minita, Poisoner, yep. Okay. And I think we're good to go. So, let's go ahead and do our rounds. Well, hello. Well, hello. Are you excited about this one? <laughs> yeah, actually, uh, yeah. I am ready to be devious here. So. Yep. This one is an interesting challenge, uh, as I, you know, what, with the Oho. <laughs> You will be choosing mm -hmm. a character and not a player. Uh, each night, choose a character. They die. If they are not in play, right. the storyteller chooses who dies. So something to keep in mind there. Okay. Um, your bluffs. I'll start with the bluffs. Your bluffs are... Yeah. Okay. Ready? Your bluffs are recluse, yep. fortune teller, and alchemist. Okay. All right. Good deal. And your very capable evil team consists of Marissa and Ryan Terry. Yay. Uh, oh, how, man, you give me the A-team. Yeah, Great. you've got the A-team. They have no excuse not to decimate this town. Okay. Any questions I'm just for me? the man for it. There you go. No. All right. Well, All I will wish you good luck. Okay, thanks. See Cheers. you. Hello. Sorry, Theo. <laughs> 
how do you feel about this? Well, I feel like I've got some uh, some excellent juice that I can, that I want everyone to try. There you go. You got the Kool Aid ready to go. Uh, might have right. to find some sunlight over there because we can barely see you. Yeah, <laughs> and unfortunately, I'll fix that momentarily, but yeah, I'll, I'll get up after we finish this thing. Uh, I, uh, I'm using natural light, and that is no longer a thing. Yeah, now I am baked in shadow like the uh, devious person I am. You're just trying to set the mood, which I appreciate. That is true. Uh, I'm here to tell you that your very capable evil team consists of your fellow minion, Marissa. All right. And your demon, Glenn. All right. Uh, I, nice. I don't see why I can't go ahead and take your poisoning now. Oh, who should it be? Writings is tempting. Uh, hmm. Let's see. It's a shot in the dark. Yeah, it's gonna be a shot in the dark. In the in the honor of cat, there will be only one cat here. Poison the cat boy. Okay, I'll take care of it. All, All right. right. Good luck. Bye, mask. <laughs> All right. Well, with that, no reason to make cat boy the drunk. <laughs> I did put that token there. I don't know what you're talking about. That was never there. You must be wrong. Um, we'll figure this out. Who is going to be our... Who should we make our drunk in that case maybe we should just leave it there i kind of don't necessarily want to poison anyone else or we could poison morgan and then that might we might be able to use oho things to simulate uh that might be fun actually okay i'm gonna try that uh drunk fool that's not a bad shake too what I was thinking about the gossip is that if the Oho misses, we can do two kills in a night, uh, which can simulate a gossip going off. Be kind of a random gossip. Well, it's up to us if we want it to go off. Um, but that is one way to trigger that. But yeah, I think a drunk fool actually does make sense because the fool is the one character on this script that can really confirm themselves. And if they are drunk, then not so much. Yeah, I think that's not a bad shout. And then we don't take away... I think good might need all the help they can get in this particular game. So, yeah, that might be all right. Let's go with that. I appreciate that, Vara. Good call. All right, let's finish up our rounds. Hello. Hello. I'm here to tell you that your very capable evil team consists of your fellow minion, Ryan Terry. Oh, of course. What is he? Oh, I can't tell you that. You're going to have to go find that on your own. Okay, and I your, guess. And your demon is Glenn. Ooh, all right. This will be delightful. I think so. I have big hopes for y'all. Okay, do I get to know what our covers are? Are you going to tell me those or no? They are called demon bluffs for a reason. Your demon gets the bluffs, Ugh. and you have to go check with your demon to get them if you want them. I guess. Okay. There, there is a role in this game called the snitch, and the snitch is a, a character, an outsider, that will tell minions bluffs, but we don't have a snitch in this game. So that's the only way that minions get bluffs. But nope, you're going to have to go talk to Glenn if you want them. All right. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Hey, Elsa. Sorry, I wasn't expecting to get woken up in the night, so I wasn't paying any attention. <laughs> it's no problem at all. Uh, yeah, how do you feel about being the amnesiac? I think it'd be cool. I, I don't know how good I'll be at guessing, but I'm very interested to find out. Have you been the amnesiac yeah. before? No, I haven't, but I've seen other people be the amnesiac. Okay. So, well, this is yeah. uh, my favorite role in the game, and so I hope you enjoy it. Are you ready to get started with it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, so then. each day privately, so I come and see you during the day. And, and yes. yes. So you can come to me yeah. during the day. I'll just make sure you request a chat with me at some point, and you can ask me a question cool. about your ability. Some people would like to start with something kind of general, like, does my ability have something to do with alignment or character roles or whatever? Yeah. Uh, or you yeah. might just ask, like, if you have an idea, just give it to me flat out, and I'll give you like a cold or a warm or a hot, you know, until you get a big <laughs> right. deal. And when, Excellent. You, when you get close enough to get a bingo, I'll give you the, the exact wording of it. Um, all right, thanks. All right, that's but uh, for tonight, I just need you to give me a number. A three. Three, okay. Yeah. With a three, you learn mica mm -hmm. draws, 
and yes. Alex. Okay. Mike and draws and Alex is what you learn. Okay, I didn't know I got night one information. That's you cool. You do. You said right. to figure out what in the world does it mean. Yes. All right. All right. I wish Thanks you good much. luck. Bye. Come chat with me tomorrow. Yeah. Bye. Yep, so three was our grandmother. There is no grandmother in play, so I gave uh, Hells Up uh, arbitrary information. All right. Next up is our poor cat boy who is poisoned. Not drunk. Never was drunk. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, and the washerwoman, of course, starts knowing one of two characters is a, or one of two players is a particular townsfolk. So I'm going to say, yeah, probably Marissa. And I might just do Ryan Terry and. Brian Terry's going to pick up on it, I think. Ooh, it's a little dangerous. I'm going to do it. Well, oh, it's, I'm going to do Ryan Terry, and I'm going to do... Possibly, ooh, Beardy, maybe. Who's going to want to hide a little bit? Oh, maybe Ridings. Ridings is going to want to hide a little bit. Or should I do both minions? I feel like that's slightly dangerous. Um, but, yeah, uh, Lancelot... Th <laughs> I... I think that might be a little bit overly powerful, so I'm limiting it to good characters. But we will try it out. We can always adjust it in the future if we need to. Um, hmm. Maybe I'll just go for it. I was just going to go for it. Ryan Terry or Marissa is the alchemist. Um, if Catboy figures it out, then that's even better. But I'm going to trust that they know what they're doing, those two. Oh, they might both say yes. Oh, it's so dangerous. I am risk averse. Yep, I'm going to do Ryan Terry in writings because I don't want to blow this game up in day one. Um, maybe I don't trust them enough, but I'm going to just go take the risk averse option. Hello, Catboy. Hello. You have a low stress game again, I think. Well, I. Yeah, like the information I'm getting from the wiki about. Um... <laughs> I like. I was literally gonna be like, "Oh, hello. How how are you doing today? Do you need me to clean anything for you?" But then it's just well, like, you are just gonna be here doing everybody's cleaning everybody's knickers for the entire game. I hope you're ready for that. Well, really, just the first night. First night, you wash some knickers and you're kind of done. Um, people only need their knickers washed once a week anyway, right? Am I right? That or I'm just a lazy washerwoman. I mean, if you turn the knickers inside out, you get a whole another two weeks out of them. So I think it's fine. No! <laughs> <laughs> but uh, here is your one and only piece of information that you get this game. Uh, okay. You learn that either Ridings or Ryan Terry is the alchemist. Okay. Exciting stuff. Okay. All right. I wish you good luck. I have a... Let's see. Hmm. Looking at what you said, Lancelot Thunderbird. Yeah, it is a little bit... Well, we're going to see how this goes. Uh, I think this script is... Confirming good players is a very important thing. Um, but, yeah, maybe I will allow... Maybe I will allow uh, the minions or something to be called. Uh, I'm kind of okay with that. Uh, I'll let y'all discuss in chat. What do y'all think? Should I allow uh, higher numbers over 17 to be called out? We can adjust this as we go. Um, I do appreciate the, the feedback. So we're, we're in this together. Let's let's get it done. Let me know. Oh, I haven't picked out names for uh, our balloonist. All right. Um, who do I want to show first? Um, Bridie's is going to get... Uh, should I go ahead and give him Ryan Terry since we have Catboy coming out for that. Is that dangerous? Maybe I'll give him that later on. Uh, who is an outsider? Maybe start with Alex. Or Pion. I'm not sure with Pion. We need to bring Pion into our game here. Pion hasn't uh, played with us before, so show the demon first. <laughs> that is kind of fun sometimes. That is kind of fun. But yeah, I think we'll start with our outsider this time. Uh, that way we have some options if uh, somebody gets poisoned later on. Um, 
Yeah. Thara says we have 20 numbers. Yeah, uh, uh, maybe we'll allow higher numbers and we'll see how this goes. Plus, they don't know exactly what's demon or minions in place. So we're going to allow all of them. I'm fine with that. Let's just allow all of them since they, you know, we don't know what's demon is in place. All right, let's go to writings. Let's get this game going. Hello. Hello. How do you feel about being Howdy the balloonist? I like it. I like um, it very much. It's it's a very it's an interesting role. There's 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 bits about it because like a recluse could mistrigger everything. Mm -hmm. You have a drunk that could make townsfolk uh, question their own sobriety. We'll say, yeah. and one good poisoning and it can throw it all off. That's true. So, you gotta so have it's to... definitely a role that wants to keep low profile and at least live for maybe four nights. Keep that balloon <laughs> under the radar, my friend. Uh, I'm That's here to I'm give you to do. your first uh, spotted person from your uh, beautiful balloon. Your first okay. spotted person is Pion. Pion. Okay. You're going to bring our new player into our game by having him spotted from a balloon. So this is Pion's first game with you all, isn't it? It is, yes. We played yesterday together uh, in one of uh, Matocat's streams. Um, but okay. Yep, this is my first time playing with them otherwise. All righty, I'll keep that in mind. All right. Well, welcome. I'm on board. I shall. I might. My what I'm thinking about bluffing as could be interesting to do to people. Oh, I'll so. have to. I'll pop into your conversations and see how it goes. Yeah, I'm still debating if I want to do it because it could be pretty mean. But it would be fun for me. <laughs> fun is fun. <laughs> well, we'll see how it goes. I trust yeah. you to, to know that line. <laughs> exactly. All right. Good All luck, right, writing. Bye bye. 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 Uh, four and is that it? Is that everything we gotta do? Is everything set up? Let's see. We have our balloonist, amnesiac, our gossip doesn't need, our gamble doesn't need anything. We did our poisonings, sweetheart, fool, poison, our drunk actually, our cannibal, our scarlet woman. Our I think we're done. I think that's everything. Let's go ahead and move on into day number one. But first of all, let me just tell you very briefly about our sponsor, Hit Point Press. Today's video is brought to you by Hitpoint Press. The deck of many animated 5e reference cards can bring even more magic to your games, and they make fantastic gifts. Get animated spell cards, condition cards, or townsfolk NPCs. You can even get in-game items like the deck of illusions and the deck of many things. Get your deck of many animated cards using the info icon in the corner or in the doohickey down below. Okay. You know what else is good? Our great well, AI. I, apparently, they've been around. Only found like we go. first saw them like a couple months ago, and I've been obsessed ever since. You know what else we're obsessed with? Our great AI overlords who are here to kill us all. Oh, yeah. I mean, to make sure our lives are peaceful and harmonious. Just ignore my body up on the clock tower. Good luck. <laughs> Did you get? Did you okay. just? Did you get demonstrated right. out of the window? Possibly. Like what the dragon statue? <laughs> Very possibly. <laughs> Let's see. Well, there's a few. Esquire. I just wanted to ask: uh, Would you happen to be the alchemist? Yes. Okay, I'm your washerwoman. Oh, you got my laundry. Yeah, I got your laundry. I got, like, your potion. Yep. Yeah, what would you like to lie about? Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to lie. I know we're supposed to lie. Right. Right. Oh, what's the worst could happen? Should I trust you? Are you are you on the good team? I'm on the good team, Jesse. yeah. Yeah, I'm on the good team. Are you on the good team, too? I'm on the good team. What an amazing coincidence. I know. But at least I get a role that makes not where I just don't want to die either. Because like I can't get executed and I need to not get killed at night. So I'm like, what here could I fucking claim Fama. that will protect me from any sort of death ever? Pharma, maybe? Because no, like, we don't want to execute a farmer because they won't jump and the demon doesn't want to kill a farmer because they... Uh, We'll jump and crack confirmation chains. So maybe? 
Yeah, I'll he say... also claim grandmother potentially because the demon will be hunting for the grandchild to try and get a double kill potentially. True. The problem with grandmother is that's something I. Mm-hmm. Okay. So you missed I all the planning, plan. Leo. No. Uh, you can summarize it for so me real we went, fast. So, okay, so Thana Marissa is the Scarlet Woman. So I said, mm-hmm. uh, out of the ones you gave me, I'll pick Recluse now out of those because Recluse is, oh, people say you're the demon. Yeah, but if they kill me off, then I'll, the demon will jump to Marissa. So we're yep. still safe for our side. And I'll play this one really chill and undercover versus being shenanigans. <laughs> so I'll just like ask people questions and stuff. I'll believe that when I see Only it. shenanigans to Ryan. <laughs> We'll let them be suspicious of Ryan. Alright. Okay. Sounds we good. get to go? Oak. I am also a talent. That's crazy. Yay! What are the odds? <laughs> Did what you are... get any information? I and... don't have any information, but if you have any people who are evil sus, I would be uh, very happy to know them. Okay. All I've talked to is Helza so far, who didn't give me much. So no no sus yet. Um, I don't I don't gather information as my role, so I'm trying I'm still trying to figure out how I'm gonna play it. Mm-hmm. You a minion. <laughs> uh, 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 yes. Yes. It's also Ooh, that would be a really good bluff if you were the Oh, to work out which characters are in the game to get people to tell you <laughs> what character they are. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm yeah, a that... trans folk, and okay. I hope um, I haven't really got any useful information mm-hmm. as yet. Um, but maybe I will. Maybe I will get some. The ball. Mm-hmm. Um, the gossip. Okay. Um. Or I am the grandmother. Okay. I know. Very interesting. Don't tell Ryan Terry you're the grandmother. You will kill you. Okay. <laughs> Ryan Terry is a proponent of grandma death every single day. He, he is. I, I, I'm, I'm glad I'm not in his family. That's all I can say. Yeah, <laughs> yeah don't tell you the grandmother to him. But right. uh, that's okay. And then I could be the recluse, the fortune teller, or alchemist. Or the what? Alchemist. Ooh, that's really. I mean, you may you, if 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 I die, you may be the farmer that's again. True. <laughs> you could you could get to be the farmer. We could all be farmers. We could all farm together in glorious con- cooperation. For Earth Day, yeah. Come plus everywhere. A bunch of crops, yeah. It's a very Earth Day thing to do. Yeah. All right, that's the plan. Bye. See you later. Bye. I mean, but it's yep, true. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you the grandmother to him, but right. uh, that's okay. And then I could be the recluse, the fortune teller, or alchemist, or the what? Alchemist. Ooh, that's really. I mean, you may you, if 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 I die, you may be the farmer that's again. True. <laughs> you could you could get to be the farmer. We could all be farmers. All farm together in glorious con- cooperation. For Earth Day, yeah. Come plus Let's everywhere. A bunch of crops, yeah. It's a very Earth Day thing to do. Yeah. All right, that's the plan. Bye. See you later. Bye. Good me. But it's yep, true. Okay. <laughs> oh, fair enough. <laughs> That's interesting. I will give my info to anyone who asks for it. <laughs> I'm not sure I trust that. <laughs> no, no, you can, can't you just talk to me. Smile. Yeah. What was I gonna say? Uh. I will give you something while everyone's in calls. I ha- I am an F roll. That's all you get. That is all we get is you are. If Marissa wouldn't outright tell him what she is. Uh, this is. But also, um, Marissa's suspicious usually anyway, so. But it's also a script called Please Lie. I, and yeah, I'm he doing wrote it. The, and... 
<laughs> and I'm doing the opposite here. Like I literally yeah. got like a first night info roll, and I'm just like, yeah. hey y'all. I mean, to, to oh, be yeah. fair, like you got a first night info roll, so like you already got all your info, and if town kills you or the demon gets you, it's not going to make a difference because you got your info. Right. Just yeah. Like, oh my gosh, y'all want to do something fun? You want to execute me? <laughs> hey, hey, Theo, is there a timer? Is there a is there a timer on town? Um, sure, I can do that. Okay, I was just like. Wanted to make sure that I'm not missing it. Uh, but yeah. I usually um, kind of go by God. I just play that two minutes. Um, well, I did with... not get first night info. On... What's today? Because I don't have my notebook. So I just have little... Ooh, that's a hard one. <laughs> that's a hard one. That is hard. Um, okay, cool, cool, cool. So how about yours? Um, well, I'm about to hard claim what I am. So I don't know if there's a purpose in me giving you a three for three. Oh, okay. Well, then what's your role? <laughs> Well, I'm going to do it in front of everyone. Oh, you're going to do it in front of everyone? Okay, that's fine. I can yeah. wait. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, bye. I'm happy to uh, I'm happy to three for three with you if you like. Or if you want a hard claim, I'm down for that. No, I don't, I don't want a hard claim. Um, three for three. I don't even know. Uh, three for three. Uh, I am not a demon. I have not got any bluffs. At all. Okay. okay <laughs> oh, am I? I? Ooh, this, are you the Do demon? You wanna... There's no magician or poppy girl in the script, so you can't be hunting for uh, demons if you're a minion. I'm not. No, there's not a Mesephali, so I can't I can't bait you with a secret word either. No, you can't, unfortunately. I'd always take a Mesephali's word. Almost always take a Mesephali's word. I will always, always take it too. <laughs> um, but we, this is our first game together, Beauty, so I have no social yes. reads on you, which is a delightful, what, delightful thing. So... You want a hard claim? Do you want to do three for threes, or how do you like to play? Um, I'm happy to follow whatever you like to do. Sure. So if I tell you, I immediately can put you into like a kill pack with me, so that if I die, like you immediately Correct. will get the wrath. Correct. Things like that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, absolutely. So absolutely. Okay. Cool. So I'm the cannibal, um, which could be good and bad for this script because it amplifies some effects. Yeah, if we kill a sweetheart or a plague doctor, then you, it can be a doubly... Always deceive me, Ryan. People deceive you. you. Oh, no, no patience. <laughs> Hello, good people oh. of Goblin Shire. Don't make me double guard, that? people. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're all back, right? Hello, good people of Goblin Shire. What have ye to share? Jesse. Uh, uh, somebody should have first night in, all right? Well, Jesse, go ahead. Um, I just want to say, I don't know if this is a good strategy or not, but I'm the fool and you should nominate me. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Well, we can see. I think that you can trust me. Wait, wait, wait. Um, wait, wait, wait. I have, have a storyteller question, Theo. Can I have a chat? Yeah, please? absolutely. I'll be right back. Yeah. Hello. Um, no, I didn't get a chance to talk That's to right. either. My Is my ability to do with people's position on the board? I will like give you the round a cold. Oh, that's, that's fascinating. Thank you. Good luck. <laughs> you want to go pray? <laughs> 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 just go pray. Yeah. Riding people? I just go out and go pray. <laughs> like, uh, I just I someone in, um, uh, on my Twitch tell me that my audio for this was low. I've been trying Ooh. to find this balance where last time I was way too loud on that's the audio for, for the stream. Um, and I tried to bring it down to be lower. You're good today. So here yeah. I have. Trying to find right on my end. On um, mine, I had you turn down a little bit, so I'll turn it back up on my end here. So, yeah. Great. Um, so, good people of Goblin Shire, I, a humble little maid, have been washing your clothes. And, um, yeah, I'm the washerwoman. Like, you guys are also a candidate for first night, like, execution. I know we don't have, like, um, 
a reason to execute daily, but you know, just in case, you just want like we don't have any other options later on. I've heard of a cannibal, so that's a good reason yeah. to hit this. Yeah, yeah cannibal is an excellent reason. That's a good shout. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. Um. So, yeah, I will share more about the laundry later. <laughs> All right. I'll also say if anybody wants to gossip, we have time for gossip. Beardy, do you want to say something first? Uh, I want to gossip. Shit. Okay. Um, Beardy, for, go for so. it. Uh, I'd like to gossip, actually, that Cannibal is a demon bluff. Okay. We Ooh. will go uh, clockwise. Ryan Terry. Uh, I would like to gossip that there are... Uh, that, that the demon is... Uh, sorry. Uh, that the demon is an imp. Okay. And Jesse. I would like to gossip that both my neighbors are good. Excellent. Aww, thanks, Jesse. Micah. I would like to gossip that Jesse is the fool. Okay. Oh, okay. boy. Like, here's the thing. If you're saying something true, do we all want people to die? Like, But then we okay. get to uh, confirm yes someone else. No. Yeah, if the gossip is something either way, if, if nobody right. got to learn their statement was false, which can be beneficial. Okay, yeah. I would like to gossip that I am not the gossip. Okay. Pion is disconnected. Oh, sorry? Oh, Pion is disconnected. Uh, uh, well, we might want to go back to one of the others because my gossip involves Pion. Uh, all right, let's see if Pion can uh, get back on. I'm going to make sure I have my Discord open in case we're having issues. Um, you, can do, you can do Morgan. She's... Yeah, we're going to keep going to Morgan. I would like to gossip that the demon is an Oho. All right, I got it. And uh, let's see. And does there, Alex, do you have one as well? Yeah, I'm going to gossip that the demon is uh, the Oho and it's Ryan Terry. Oh, okay. So double. All right. Oh. Oddly specific. Uh, I'm back. And what the world have I done to deserve this slam? Everything, Love Ryan. Ryan. Love you, Ryan. Uh, you know my what? gossip is if I were to keep, if I were an empath, I would have a zero okay. with my neighbors. Excellent. Uh, All right. Those are our gossips. Feel free if you have one later on to uh, raise your hand, but I'll go ahead and open nominations otherwise. You should kill me, because this is the only time we can check for sure. Yeah, you could nominate yourself. Well, okay. Will you vote for it if I nominate myself? <laughs> I'll nominate. Wait, but wouldn't it be more useful for you to just, like, not die? Because, like, no. the demon... Because if a demon well, hits you, that's still good, though. I don't think like, any of these demons can hit me. We don't anybody. have to kill anybody tonight. Well, and that leaves I mean, more void I, votes open I would, later. I would disagree with that. Um, yeah. One, Je if, if, if Jesse really is the fool, this would be the one time we could really confirm her as a particular role as a townsfolk, and then we could yeah. technically just share all information with Jesse to be the most informed person in town. Yeah. Because oh, yeah. confirmably, okay. she would be good. There's yeah. nothing yeah. on the script that would do otherwise. Well, yeah, then, really a trusting game. Then I will nominate Jesse. Okay, you can't play. Anything you want to add to that? Um, Jesse, thine flower crown blooms eternal. <laughs> may, and like, may. What is with you today? That's why you say it's fun. I like it. No, it, it blooms eternal. It blooms with good. I don't want to do this, but it feels like we should. Oh, good. good. Yeah. Showing Love up it. our AI overlords already. Jesse, anything you want to say in your defense? Um, I won't, unless I'm poisoned. This would suck if I was poisoned. <laughs> 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 this would be really funny. This would be really funny, and I'm totally fine if that happens because it's really funny. But yeah, I'm excited to not good. die. All right. We'll go ahead this and run the vote. Make it beatable. So. Well, no, don't make it simple. Kill me. Well, if, if we try to kill you and you don't die, then hey. Oh, that's but right. Hey, Jesse, die. what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Hey, that sounds that's, like a song. That's literally the right. right. so I didn't know, know that you were drunk. Cap, Cap, what was your information as Washerwoman? Um, 
Yes. I have a particular role that I don't want to share as of right now. However, I can con confirm that my two people... Um, I haven't talked to actually both of my people, so I want to withhold before I um, put that Okay. Uh, okay. Chill. Any other nominations today? Mm -mm. Do we have a noble that wants to go forward? Oh. No. Come, like... come forth, you prissy, prissy little. <laughs> come <laughs> forth, you aristocrat, you dirty aristocrat. <laughs> Sorry, that was the first word that came to mind. Final call. <laughs> Five, There's nothing wrong with dirty because we love the earth. Four, yeah, it is Earth Day. Three, Roll yeah, it is Earth Day. We love two, we love dirt. We one. love soil. Okay, nominations are closed, and now I turn it over to my AI assistant, who came up with this execution uh, fable for Jesse. In Ooh. jest, this is based only on your name. In jest, the town did decree, bind them to the windmill, let it be. As blades were, Jesse's jests are through, spun out of sight into the blue. Jesse is executed and dies. Oh! Good night, everybody. I'm, I'm so sorry. Ah, oh, that was fun. Thank you for that moment, Vara. I think it was, who was the one that came up with that originally? Was it Vara? Uh, yes, it was. Excellent, excellent. Ah, fun moment already. All right, what do we need to do tonight? We've got a busy night. Let's go ahead and get to it, shall we? Um, switch this over. All right, our music. I have a friend that goes to Burning. Hello. Hello, Theo. All right. Well, it sounds like I sounds like I, I poisoned my clothes. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, well, okay. Um, I'm gonna go on my. I, I don't have a whole ton to go on, but none of the people that I talked to today ended up feeling like it was something that maybe Helza. I got kind of a weird vibe from Helza, but I'm gonna go off my instinct and just poison writing and see what happens. Okay, I'll take care of it. Good luck. Yep. Hello, sir. Hello. Yeah, how's it going? Going well, really well. You feel like taking a roll of the dice tonight? Uh, yeah, I will. I'll gamble Pion as the Plague Doctor, please. All right. I will let you know how that works out. Maybe. Right, thank you. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> All right, yeah. Pion as the Plague Doctor. And this is just fine. So, yeah, uh, again, if you haven't seen the gambler before, each night choose a player and guess their character. If you guess wrong, you die. But purity is okay for now. Uh, we'll see how this gossip thing plays out. We'll figure that out in a second. Uh, Marissa, we don't have to worry about yet. And let's go see what Glenn decides to do. <laughs> hey, Glenn. Well, All right, so, so one far, day. pretty fun. Yeah, I, uh, that was an interesting kill. But um, So, a roll. I am going to go for Plague Doctor, hoping that that gives you some interesting ability. Okay, I uh, will... Take care of it one way or the other. Okay. Good luck. See ya. All right. So, uh, yep, we're going to oh ho kill our plague doctor. And as I said in the beginning, I think probably the one that makes the most sense, we can see our jinxes down below. Uh, goblin, plague doctor, scarlet woman. We can't do that. Uh, I'm not really going to do evil twin. I think it's going to have to be the goblin. And so... What we're going to do is we're going to give one of our existing minions the goblin ability. And I think it's going to be Ryan Terry, of course. So, yeah, I think that is going to be uh, what we do there. So let's go ahead and let Ryan Terry know. My yeah. chats, folks. There you are. <laughs> why, why am I getting another chat, Theo? You know? That's good news, I think. Um, you have also gained the ability of the goblin. Have I really? Interesting. Have. Interesting. Okay. And cool. so you probably know the only reason that would really happen is that a yeah. plague, plague doctor has died. So if the plague doctor dies, a living minion gains the goblin ability in addition to their own ability and learns this. So cool. there you go. <laughs> All powerful Terry. Ever, the town is feared this forever. You're a I hope minion. there's not a poisoner out there who could take that away from. Oh, wait. <laughs> All right. Good luck. Thank you. 
chaos agent. Is there a token for this? Uh, I don't think so. I don't see a old plague doctor thing. Uh, storyteller ability. Well, let's do that. <laughs> Excellent. All right. So that was our oh ho. Where we go next? Our gossip. Who's our gossip kill going to be? Um, I don't necessarily want to. Oh, we can punish. Well, maybe we'll do the washerwoman. I think the washerwoman might be all right for that. And that also prevents a cannibal from getting that ability, but it protects our more powerful roles that still exist. So I'm okay with that. And we'll put that over there. And, and then give writings Terry as a demon. Yeah, <laughs> I think that might be fun. Um, Beardy gambled Pion as the plague doctor, and so it was just fine. Um, Ridings Terry as a demon, that's fine. You really wanting to give Ridings Ryan Terry, should we, as the demon? Yeah, I'm okay with that, if y'all think that's the right move. Um, let's see, where are we? I'm losing track of my night order by looking at chats. Uh, yeah, so we've decided that is five. Number six is our sweetheart. Sweetheart did not die. Number seven is Elza. Let's go take care of this. Hello. Hey, All right. I need a number, please. Well, any number in the world or a number between some number of numbers. Uh, you give me a number and I will tell you if it is a valid selection. 47. That is an invalid selection. 11. 11, I can take. Um, you learn. You learn. I'm sure I've done this, my stuff correctly. Mm -hmm. You learn writings and Ryan Terry. Thank you. Okay, good luck. <laughs> I have a spreadsheet over here, but I don't trust it. I probably just need to trust it. I think it's correct. I'll just trust it from now on. I took care of it later. I always doubt myself. I need to get some confidence on my own decisions earlier in the day. I was drinking coffee at the point when I made that spreadsheet. I am sure it's fine. All right. Excellent. I think Hells will figure it out eventually. Seven and eight writings. Sure. Uh, since Ryan Terry is a like, anyway, it's actually potentially helpful for evil still. Okay, let's do it. I don't say that I don't take advice. Um, seen as the demon. And this way we do protect our demon and our Scarlet Woman, so it's fine. Uh, and also, he'll probably be read as a townsfolk, since there's multiple people pointing to him as the alchemist. Um, it is the most fun option. And Lancelot, I do appreciate the fun options. And... Typically in my games, Ryan Terry just ends up with all the reminder tokens on him anyway, so let's make it happen. Hello. Hello! You're still alive! I'm surprised, actually, but it, yeah. Well, let me give you a name uh, from your balloon. Uh, what color is your balloon? Um, I currently see a blue balloon, oh, but... Okay. Well, from your uh, balloon uh, in the sky, no matter what color it is, you see Ryan Terry and Mask. Right, I see two people. Well, mask just... is his cat. <laughs> you see oh, Ryan Terry uh... and his cat mask. All right, Ryan Terry and his kitty cat mask. This is okay. Correct. Cool. Uh, good luck. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm. And I think that is everything for the evening. Oh wait, we have a cannibal. I should have done the cannibal. Oh well, the cannibal just gains the fool's. Well, the drunk's ability. So it doesn't really have an ability today. So nothing to do there. Uh, I do need to remember that because Kendall is not on the night order list, so let me know if I ever miss that. Uh, glancing around, I think we've taken care of the gambler and the gods have been out. I think we're good to go. All right, let's go into day number two. What? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Okay, I'm ready for this. Good morning. I was either poisoned or drunk. Hold on, Continue. everybody. Hold on. Good morning, everybody. 
uh, I need to, again, turn it over to our AI overlords because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this morning, let's see, as the moon cast shadow, as the moon cast shadows deep and long, their laughs were silenced mid song, found in a tulip patch laid quite flat, a prank gone mm -hmm. wrong. That was that with petals askew, the dawn finds Pion no longer in view. Oh. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, as, the night, as the night purrs on, a tale of nine lives, their adventure takes a dive. Chased by a giant ball of yarn, they found their end in a knitter's bond. With threads intertwined, the dawn finds Catboy's bind. <gasps> Oh, oh shit! shit. Wow. Yes. I can you explain. You know what I'm talking about? Was oh, correct, oh. maybe. Yeah, I can explain. <laughs> I can Good partially day, explain, maybe. Wow. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh. All right, we knew what Catboy was. Pion, what, what were you? I yeah, was the I plague know. doctor. Oh, 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 no. no. I told only Beardy. I'm looking at you, Theo. I'm looking at you. Disney <laughs> <laughs> Probably the drunk then? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm thinking. Jesse was be. the drunk. There yeah. is a godfather who chose so high or Catboy. Mm -hmm. There wasn't a godfather and Pion died to the demon. Godfather. Now to to be fair, uh, another that might not entirely be true. There could also be that whoever if there is a gossip, that their gossip ran true. That's true. Yeah. That's also oh, true. Okay. Oh. All right. Yeah. But right. what ability uh, did Theo okay. get himself when Pion died? If he got the Godfather ability, he could immediately use it to kill a second player if Jesse is. <laughs> so, Cat, so Catboy, uh, I don't. I, uh, I'm thinking the storyteller wouldn't kill Pion for the gossip. Well, the story if Pion tell, the yeah. Story. Uh, well, um, would they? Would they be like this? Is kind of selfish. He <laughs> 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 is very that, selfish. But... Now <laughs> he not, just not really to... wants those abilities, that Theo. <laughs> Not to be crass, yeah, in a yeah. Fangu world, Pion could have just jumped to someone, though, too. That is also... Uh, uh, I have information oh, okay. that suggests that that's not possible, no. Okay, excellent. I'd love to hear it. Yeah. <laughs> either the Godfather what or... It's either the Godfather or because I was the only one who hard claimed last you know, in the day. Possibly. Possibly. So, yeah. yeah. Alright, um... Just wanted to confirm because I was like, I don't remember the life of me what her gossip was. Yeah, no, I wrote it down because I'm writing it down to keep track. Uh, yeah. Just in case things like this happen. Um, yeah. Okay. okay. Well, um, I think because no, Pion did know I was going to gamble them. Interesting. Unless they found a point. Although we did have the very first chat, the very so. They're not the poisoner, okay. but they could have later on talked to. The minions found it. It was a poisoner and got me poisoned, potentially. Okay. But the, the likelihood's low. It's but likelihood it's low. It's low at this stage. So. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That, that that is some credibility there, as long as you because yep. in the world where you'd be lying, you would be a minion, and at at present, you are not my at least my number one minion candidate. Um, <laughs> Good. Good. Why is that? Uh, <laughs> uh, Marissa? Is that how you say her name? Mar Mary yep. Marissa? Marissa. 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 Uh, she refused to give me anything. Not a two <laughs> for two, a three for three. I had to almost crawl out of her that if she was asked to, if she was townsfolk or outsider. Um, like, yeah, okay. any, like any, so since she wasn't willing to give me anything and we were the only people in town and we were, then we went to private... <laughs> I'm assuming she was a minion that didn't have a bluff yet. It's potential. She may also, it could be her play style where she. Yes, and that's true. But she did plays say that. like she that. Said, that. Said, Circle. I was told cold. Night on the suit. Okay. I was asked to choose a number and I said, could it be any number? And um, Theo said, uh, choose a number and he'd tell me if it was a valid number to choose or not. So I chose 47 and was told it was an <laughs> invalid number. So I presume the number has possibly to be to do with how many players we have. So I chose right. 11 and I was told Ridings and Ryan Terry. It doesn't right. seem to have anything to do with things like 
how many letters are in people's names or what their names start with or anything because I can't see anything in common with you and Michael Draws the three. Right. And writing some Ryan Terry for 11, uh, you know, like there aren't 11. So, yeah, um, I do not even know what... Reasonable shout. It's a reasonable yeah. shout. I could, I, could po- I could poison Beardy theoretically if... Yeah, either... If that- keep, we keep going in and just, just in case. Maybe we hit... Because you never know. Maybe I hit the demon and then that's just like... Real. Right. If I can find well, it, and honestly, if I can find the demon with it, that was another reason I hit Catboy because sometimes I'm I'm of the opinion first night info shouldn't get to fucking everything up. So if he is a minion that's out there trying to like poison the well with first night info, uh, right. I would to, to hit him with it. And if he's the demon, then all the more is the better. But he was he, I, I don't I I didn't really think it was going to be the demon, so I'm going to try and move on. I would see if like it it like maybe your ability is is based on like. Like you said, position like as in like, like are they beside each other or something like that? You could like guess well, the line. Be- if we have a perhaps third outsider and it's a Fangu game, couple of possibilities of what happened last night, and I don't know which it is. There's 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 a couple. An Oho could have said something, listed something out, and then Theo decided to kill two because deaths are arbitrary. Oh. Um that's one I didn't even consider. Jesse could have been a drunk and a godfather got an extra kill last night. Yeah. Or a gossip said a true gossip and someone died. Those those yeah. are the three I those are the three I see. Yeah. Uh, or someone was a grandmother to that cat boy in theory was a grandmother to Pion and then that but that doesn't make sense with no, what Catboy Catboy wasn't was a grandmother. Playing. Oh, if Pion yeah. was Catboy's no, because Pion's claiming plague doctor, and if you yeah. were like, we would just say you're the grandmother if you were killed in the as the grandmother. Yeah, that's the only like, other mechanical really, thing, but that doesn't really fit anything they're saying. Yeah. Um, okay. What's so, up? what would you like to do? Twos, threes? Any info you wish to share or suspicions? I'm the gossip. Excellent. <laughs> what did you gossip? <laughs> Uh, that the demon is an oho. Okay. Well, that is possible. Uh, because there's a number of reasons last night could have happened. Don't know if that's... True. There is a world where the oho said plague doctor to get their minions extra powers. Yeah, yeah no, that's what I was thinking. True. Yeah. It's a possibility. But also, yeah. uh, Jesse could be drunk. All right, I'll let you take that. All right, I will see you later. Night one was asked to pick a number. I picked the number three, and I was told Michael draws an Alex. Night, okay. and I guess if it had to do with position on the board, and I was told no. Three or cold. cold. So night mm. two, I guessed a number 11, and was to... thought about whether or not... Uh, Jesse was the fool, but they were poisoned. If it was a poisoner game, it, it's it's one of it's those possible. Two okay, it's, possible. Well, it's it's, it's oh, still too it's early. Got a it one in no idea. I have an idea. Poison. I have an idea. What's your idea? Yeah, you know, check. Um, oh, hmm? whose idea? Oh, they, oh they yeah. Okay, so Theo, so Theo of fables are are fables active? Uh, yes. Yes, I should have mentioned that before we started. Yes, there's a sentinel in play, which means there may be one extra or one fewer uh, outsider in play. Oh, What's... so we have a possibility of having up to five outsiders. Yeah. Okay. So the outsider is going to be a little tricky. And also, what's what's the rule of the genie? Uh, if you scroll to the bottom of the character sheet, it should say the jinxes. And that's just the gen just tells you there's jinxes in play. And the jinxes oh. are for the Plague Doctor and for the Fangu plus Scarlet Woman. Okay. Well, then, I need to start checking that tab. 30 seconds. So, as a washer, I'll just tell you this, Marissa. As a washerwoman, I've tried talking to both of them. So, they can't get no, two kids. Godfather's only during the day. Oh, so uh, if so outside is only dying during the day, so you died at night, you're fine. There's no Godfather uh, kill today. If unless we kill another so, outside, so Godfather can't get a kill off of me because I died at night. No, because you died at night. Godfather specifically has to be outside of dying during the day. So. Hi. Oh, cool. Yeah. Yeah. You ask me something. 
I well, tried, Cat Boy. I tried. Yeah. Uh, well, so I was just going to share. Oh, let's wait for Micah and Alex. Three, two, one. Double dong. Kick up. Oh, it happened. Oh, oh, God. God. Alex and Micah get do double donged. Well, so uh, the shame. The first time. Wait, what? Shame. Ding, the, ding. The double gong. Shame. So ding, ding. I would, um, as the washerwoman, just to further um, build trust with the community, I want to share that um, I was able to confirm the role. I'm not going to confirm the role, but I it think it's up. it's it's good to show that um, the townsfolk is among us. So uh, I got Ryan Terry confirmed um the role that i was given okay oh okay so, so Ryan just like, oh, yeah okay yeah i i would did, rather not you... share exactly what it is just in case there's an oho out there who could use it to kill me but catboy, yeah. how, catboy how did you reveal your information um i asked him uh, if I, he was a specific role, and he said yes. So he could have just read that that was what you were doing then, right? Well, but he also had a, pre um, a prepared thing specific to that role that um, mm -hmm. would have been to either he's got that, he's got that Riz, or he's just. Um, <laughs> I mean, Ryan's got Riz. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna break down and play that. Um, but but I, just, I, I, I don't. I don't know what Riz is, but I'll. I'll claim to have it. Sure. Charisma. I've, I've definitely, Charisma. Definitely seen. Charisma. I'm not among the well, to, yeah. it could, to, if you, there could have been. There could have been shenanigans there, depending on how you revealed your yeah. information. Understood. We're but, open for uh, gossips, by the way. Raise your hand if you want to. Oh, what do you want to gossip? Oh, yeah. oh I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> we'll start with writing. Dead uh, I would like to gossip that Ale Alex is good. Okay, easy enough. Yeah. Morgan. I would like to gossip that we don't have a grandmother in this town. All right, I got it. <laughs> Beardy. I'd like to gossip that Alex is evil. Okay, Ooh. got it. Ooh. Ryan Terry. I would like to gossip that the demon is uh, on the right side, not including the 12 and uh, 6 o'clock position. The demon is what? riding <laughs> through you inclusive? Correct. Okay, got it. Okay. Alex. You didn't get your name out of my mouth. I gossip that Beardy's the demon, there specifically the Oho. Ooh. Okay. Jesse, you're dead. You want to say something? <laughs> I would like to gossip that um, you're lying and I'm not dead. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Je Jesse claims Zumble. Micah draws. <laughs> Uh, I would like to gossip that uh, Ryan Terry is good. All right. Marissa oh, I should put my hand down. I would like to gossip that the demon is on the lower half of the map Ooh. under the three and six. So, so Micah, Micah to Beardy Jesse, inclusive? Beard. Yeah, Micah to so Beardy. In yeah, Micah and Beardy inclusive. All right. Okay. All right. Uh, Ryan Terry, your hands up for a reason, or just have them put down? All right. No. All right. I would like to gossip that I'm dead. For a reason. I forgot to hit the space button. <laughs> That's all right. I just play Mask. Um, okay. Uh, we're open for nominations or any other gossips or anything else you want to do. Hell's up. Uh, another question. Thank you. Oh, yeah. sure. Yeah. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Hello. Hey. Uh, very confused. Um, does my ability have to do with whether abilities are functioning correctly. You are cold. Okay. You'll get this. Yeah. That's what the yeah, story can tell her. I mean, she, she might be asking about her powers. Yeah. yeah. It, it's so I confusing. I think I know what the demon is. Some things are ah. confusing. It yeah, and when you put all these roles together, it's just like, who it's am a lot. I? 
Theo, are, 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 are nominations open? Yes. Yeah. Uh, writings will nominate Marissa. All right. Hi. Oops. Bye. That's who I wanted to kill. Go ahead, tell us about <laughs> um, I got some pretty what? sus vibes day one. And from what I'm hearing from town, no one can really say anything positive currently about Marissa or her role. Oh, no. Not, 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 not of, like the person as a character, like, hey. Um, but, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, person. but yeah, that's what I want to clarify. Clarify. Um, but oh, no, I'm just sus in general. <laughs> oh, I, I, th I think Marissa's a minion based on my conversation with her. Um, she, when our conversation, she wasn't willing to give me a two or a three or anything in general about her role. Uh, not even willing to lie about a three. Mm -mm. Um, so that just seems kind of sus to me. Uh, mm -hmm. She did say, hey, I tend to keep stuff to the chest on the day, day one. You can ask people who've played with me before. So I asked Micah, and he said he couldn't remember that ever happening. So... <laughs> <laughs> I, I said I didn't never tracked it though to be fair yeah, so, <laughs> I can never confirm nor deny I never paid yeah. attention to that before so I, I'm thinking I also usually just dance in town square the whole time so <laughs> actually, I, can, I actually can't confirm that I actually can't confirm so with that. that in mind I'm not thinking Marissa's a demon but I do think she's a minion at this time unless someone has anything that would help support her Marissa I mean this is absolutely my play style is my play style is don't give information on night one because you don't know everything. Um, try to keep people alive as long as possible. I never like to nominate people to die early as possible, especially if we don't have a demon uh, that you have to kill people or else you lose. Um, I also play it close to chess because I currently have a power that's very informative. And if you don't kill me now, the demon's going to kill me. Um, and I have information from the last couple of nights so if you want that information to keep going keep me alive all right Majority. i have received the information the only thing i must say is you're one of the people who i said i am an f name what a what 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 Wait, what? 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 What, did, what did you say uh, I know that Marissa is one of the few people I talk to, and I'm like, I'm an F name, but also before that I said I have a mask on. Oh, so oh. she might have known that you were actually the plague doctor, is what you're saying. Here you go. Potentially. Five That's all I can majority. do. Sorry. I'm yeah. going to be real honest, I don't even know what the F name means. Nobody's yeah. ever used that terminology with me before. Can we put it at least to be on the block? I'm just saying oh, okay. it's a possibility. It's a possibility. It's possible. Yeah, let's, let's keep it up to five. It's fine. Okay. Like, five. I don't even, though, I, I'm going to be totally honest. I don't know what F name means, like, at all. Uh, like, just, I think he, they meant, like, characters with an F name. Oh. Uh, right. Okay. Okay. All right. Other nominations. Um, I nominate Beery. Okay, Ryan Ooh. nominates Beardy. Tell us why. Uh, there's just been a couple of things going around that feel a little bit sus uh, in terms of how uh, I know that uh, Pyron indicated that uh, they were one of the couple of people that the role had been indicated to, and uh, it was a powerful thing that got killed quickly. I've heard a couple other people act a little bit like they felt like he was sus. Throwing it out there, I don't feel particularly strongly one way or the other. I haven't even gotten a chance to talk to Beardy. <laughs> but, uh, uh, but 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 ultimately, just trying to uh, throw out because this might be this might actually be writings himself noted that he didn't think that Marissa was a demon kill. He was feeling mm -hmm. like a minion. Maybe this is a demon kill. Might be better. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's worth a shot. All right, Beardy. Why should we not defenestrate you? Uh, well, <laughs> I did know that uh, what Pine was was claiming. I think. He indicated we talked first that I might be the only one he told. Um, I'd give myself away pretty obviously if I immediately killed the plague doctor if I was was the demon mm. and was the only one who knew. Uh, I'm not the worst kill, but I uh, have a pretty good role that can get a lot of information. Can I? Add I won't let a tie. So let, let me let me ask you this, Beardy. If your role is uh, is your role something that a, that a cannibal can maybe make good use of if we killed you anyway? Just as a 50-50 shot from a town perspective. Uh, I think it'd be dangerous for Cannibal to have this role. Okay. 
All right. Five, can I also five, add five. Beardy has hard claimed their role to me, and me knowing their role, I can also see because I have a plan with Beardy, and we're going to see if that gets enacted. Okay, plans are afoot. Five to tie, yeah. six to execute. Yeah. yeah. No. Like, I'm a completely safe kill if we need to kill somebody. Like, there will be more information that we can get if I stay alive, but, like, if it, I end up dying, I end up dying. Yeah, if Barry yeah. ends up evil, I'll keep an eye on him, but for now, I want him alive. <laughs> Three's not enough. Okay. Oh, but you knocked, okay. you defenestrated him, clearly. Uh, that's the last <laughs> of the stream. Any he rage quit. Any other nominations? <laughs> Final call. Four, three, two, one. When we don't have our beloved victory bell here, Marissa is our traditional day two kill. <laughs> no, I didn't know that. Uh, no. We do have to keep up with tradition, and if we like told you that, then it would be biased everything. Um, that Marissa, is fine if I am dead. There well, is information I need to tell Well, not right you. now, though, Marissa, because right now... Marissa, Dead. known for her sweet berry pies, met her end under fruity skies. Tossed <laughs> into the berry bin, they cried, where she vanished with the a berry drenched tide, with a stain so red the dawn finds Marissa's berry bed. And <laughs> dies. Good night, everybody. Hey. Okay. These donuts are great. Welcome back. Let me drag all my windows out of the way so I can see what's happening. Uh, Glenn, unfortunately, lost his safety net uh, since Marissa was uh, a little bit caught off unawares in those early chats. Sometimes you just got to lie. You just got to run with it. Just make things up. You can always backtrack later. Um, stream of studying dying. Just me. Working fine here. Uh, please let me know if there's other issues. We have had Twitch issues in the past. If anything... Uh, is uh, trouble uh, we can always refresh also we stream on youtube live so if you're having trouble with twitch you can visit us at youtube.com slash the gallant goblin and we should be streaming there as well um yes i need to find out what marissa was bluffing though because i'm not actually sure uh so we can go ahead and check on that in the best hey hello i just wanted to see what you were bluffing i didn't catch that just in case just oh fortune notes. teller fortune teller all right just wanted to make sure thanks okay I, like and we have some from like years ago. I'll see if I can find them. I've seen it's, people who have them living kind of on their person, where like the ferret more or less lives in their pocket and they take it around everywhere with them. But that's a bit different than yours. Yeah. Well, it's so funny because like I feel like in a suburb of West Virginia, that would be kind of like okay, that was a thing that happened. But it's like if you did that in New York, people would. All right. Let me just check all my notes here. Um, yeah, if they're evil, you are poisoned. So I can play it as pretty second. We're going to uh, Mike is poisoned, so we're going to go through the motions of the fortune teller. So the fortune teller, you choose two players. You learn if either is a demon. So we're going to go through that with Micah today. But yeah, uh, it won't get accurate information, obviously. Okay, let's go through our night. Um, so it goes into, I guess, yeah, three. Perfect. Oh, that works well. Thank you. I forget. Was it Lancelot who told me about that trick? Uh, appreciate that. Awesome. Let's see what happens. Oh, New York, York rats are scary. Hello. Hello. Well, interesting situation. Ups and guys. downs, ups and downs. Yeah, poor Marissa. Maybe I should have uh, given her the goblin ability. Yeah, maybe. Um... How does that, out of curiosity, and maybe just because chat may be curious as well, if a Scarlet Woman is given the Goblin power and eventually gets past the Demon, what happens? Um, I let's see what it says. Uh, if they play Doctor Dusty, a living minion gains the Goblin ability. So I would assume that since they're no longer a minion, they would no longer have that ability. Hmm. Interesting. That's probably that's something. I mean, it's not going to be relevant here. I'd be curious to hear like. That's like a I'd, fair I'd be question. curious to take that to, to the Pandemonium Institute. Yeah, anyway, for in the per, in the time, uh, I'll 
I'll continue poisoning writings for in the interest of time here. I'm not, I don't have a great set to go elsewhere right now. Okay. I'll take care of it. Good luck. Yep. Uh, thank you for letting me know I'm a little quiet. I turned up my mic a little bit. Uh, I'm going to sit a little closer. Let me know if that's any better. I appreciate that. Uh, keep it on writings. Poor writings is going to get completely bunk information. Um, yeah, but does the new demon uh, then still maintain that Plague Doctor given ability? Um, I tend to think not, but, you know, let me know what y'all think. All right, number two. Hello. Hi, Theo. How's it going? <laughs> good. How's it going for you? Yeah, pretty good. Um, might die tonight. We'll, we'll see. I'm enacting a plan to find out uh, about Jesse. I would like to gamble Jesse mm -hmm. as... Oh, do I go full or drunk? It's one of those two. Let's go with drunk. We'll go Jesse as the drunk. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that is accurate. Um, we do have a death over here to deal with. Yeah, uh, I think Morgan's going to have to be a little bit more strategic with how she is doling out her gossip abilities <laughs> so she doesn't just decimate the town along with the demon. But we'll see how this turns out. I'm tempted to kill Morgan with her own gossip for that one uh, so that it doesn't get too out of hand. Sorry, Morgan, but you got two good gossips off before I murdered you. All right, so that's number two. Number three is... Our cannibal. Oh, yeah. So we usually go over to... Uh, does a fortune teller usually act before... Yeah, three. Uh, yeah, fortune teller goes before the demon, I guess. Is that accurate? I just want to double check. Um, no. No, fortune teller doesn't. Wait. Is it, oh, it's, yeah, it goes later. Fortune teller doesn't go now, right? Wait, the cannibal lets you know the ability to question. Uh, see, do you do it... In the order in which the cannibal is in the night order? I guess you do. I guess you don't do it in the order in which the fortune teller is. So yeah, all right, we'll go ahead and do it. Uh, if that's wrong, let me know, but I'm going to blame the app. Hello. Hello. I was wondering if I was going to get woken up tonight. You are. I barged into your bedroom and demanded that you give me two names. Two names. Okay. Uh, let's do, um, let's do Alex and Helza. Okay. You look at Alex and Helza and you learn no. All right. Okay. Thank you very much. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I figured a no there probably makes sense. Helza's clearly not going to be, I don't think, I don't want to throw too much sauce on Helza. And I don't know, I don't think... Alex is going to be too, I don't know, maybe. I didn't know who I wanted to frame in that point, but it just felt like no was the right answer. Uh, let's see. Now we go to our demon. Hello. Well, that took longer than I expected. And uh, things have to go down in yeah, specific orders. Yeah, things I happening. It's in and order. Sometimes chat wants to chat. Um, oh, but well. you've lost your safety net, so you got to play it cool. Yeah, um, I know. Who do you want to yeah, target okay, today? Yeah. Uh, cannibal. All right. I'll take care of it. Good luck. Okay. Cheers. All right. Yeah, the cannibal got their information, and that is that. Yeah, also, I didn't want to too much choreograph that Marissa was evil by giving maybe information to Micah that would be too easily discovered. So that's my thinking there. Um, uh, you put died on a skeleton woman, but she's faking being later in the night order. Yeah, that yeah, that might be why it pops up. Um, we'll try. I have to experiment with this. So hopefully that was I did that in the correct order. Maybe I did not. You were supposed to put the poison token on Micah instead of die today on Marissa. I think it did it still. Let's see. Yeah, that doesn't put any kind of order on him. So, yeah, so, but it did, yeah, put a three. So if I put it on, let's say if I put it on the balloonist. We're playing around. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it should have come later. So Mike got some extra information there. Um, but I don't think it caused any harm. So, yep, uh, a little storyteller mistake there, but we're learning as we go. Appreciate that help. 
yeah, that's what I thought, Mayo. Um, but yeah, we're, we're learning together here, so we're all good. Uh, now, as far as the gossip, I'm going to kill Morgan with her own gossip there because the gossip is getting a little bit out of hand. Uh, sweetheart has died. Helza. Hello. Hello. All right, I need um, another number. Zero. I need another selection, please. Okay, uh, two. Two. And you learn Pion and Catboy. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Good luck. Thank you. Okay, yeah. Okay. I hope I hope that'll help. I hope that'll help. Let's see. Um Oh, thank you, Lancelot. I appreciate that. Backing me up a little bit there. Uh, yeah, to a cat boy. Uh, yeah, washerwoman pointing at cat boy. Hopefully that'll register. I oh, hope so. Come on. Come on. You got this. I'm going to be adding all those evil rolls to my spreadsheet, too. All right. Seven. Let's get this game rolling. Right. Who are we going to give writings? Poisoned again. Um, who are we throwing under the bus? Um... What do we have left? We have Minion and Townsfolk. Um, uh, right, Terry again is a Townsfolk. No, I, I might give Beardy because Beardy is pretty good at this game. Beardy as a Minion. And then we'll have the Townsfolk that we can use later on. Um, but Beardy will eventually die probably for his own ability. Could give Alex as a minion. I'm not opposed to that. Because Alex is going to stay alive as a sweetheart unless Tom executes them. I'm going to give Alex as a minion. Because we don't have minion yet. We have the demon, we have a minion, and we have an outsider. Uh, yeah. Okay. I think Alex might be a good shout. Yellow window could change mine, but we're going to go for it. I'm alive. You are still alive, and I have a new name for you. All right. You learn today, Alex. Alex. Excellent. All right. Okay. Do you have any any suspicions on where these people lie? Um. Well, Pion claims to be the plague doctor. Um. Alex gave me. She was the first person I spoke to. Went right to her in the beginning of game because, as I've learned from history, or at least the recent history, um, Alex tends to vote on me in the final rounds. So if I could build rapport with Alex early this game, I thought I wouldn't be a false demon in her eyes. So I went right to Alex and went, "Hey, you want a hard claim? I don't have demon bluffs," and she was she was down for it. Okay. So, so, so I'm. Uh, I'm leaning to if, if I go if I trust that information, that would mean Ryan is most likely my minion. If Alex told me the truth, unless Alex is my demon, De Alex could have the demon bluffs right from the get go, and be running with that. But what she told me her role, and I, I, I audience would know in theory, um, she told me cannibal. And with this script, with no widow or spy. Picking cannibal as your demon bluff, that is that is a rough one to gamble on. All right. So uh, that's where I'm leaning. If I trust both of them, that means Ryan is probably minion or demon. Well, let's see if you I'll be get... curious to see who I get tomorrow. Yeah, we'll find out, I hope. Good luck, right? Yeah, no, I'll, I'll probably be do gossip dead or demon dead by... Because always, the last one for the balloonist, they never get it. I know. <laughs> I'm rooting for you. I'm rooting for you. All right, thank you. Good luck. Poor writings. Uh, poor writings. Uh, does not know in theory. Uh, okay. I think we're good. Oh, yeah. Balloonist here is a good thing. If we had like a pit hag, I wonder if you could actually give them multiple names, uh, the same person for multiple roles with things like pit hag changing them. It would be fun. Uh, I believe that is the last thing we need to do tonight. So we are going into what day number three, I believe. So let's get to it. Okay. 
Good morning. Good morning, Goblinshire. In the dead of night, the sea did call. They answered, embracing the thrall. Their boat adrift in a foggy haze with no return, the dawn finds Morgan's final gaze. Oh no. I, I love that it Ooh. went with like an ocean theme because my yeah. name yeah. means Ed the sea. <laughs> in the depths of night where yeah. echoes bind their fate with rocks entwined, caught in a landslide during their slumber, buried beneath without a number, with stones piled high, the dawn finds Micah nigh. Why do we keep having oh, two? No. Wait, two again? Well, I always think gossip, and that gossip. might have been my fault. <laughs> what was your uh, gossip uh, <laughs> yesterday? Well, you I misunderstood the assignment and gossiped that there's no grandmother, and I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, uh, well, that confirms yeah. you, Micah. Do you have anything to share with class? <laughs> Not right now. Oh. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I need, wow. I've got another question about this game, so I need to talk to you again, Theo. Please. I'm right here. <laughs> Hello. Uh, Hello. <laughs> does um, does this have anything to do with the order of people awaken in the night? Cold. Okay. Thank you. Let's, so let's let's um, what what are your theories on what the numbers might mean? Well, this just so many few things that seem to have to do with actual numbers so uh i think we've covered all three of them to do with where people were sitting which it doesn't seem to be to do with um abilities and to do with yeah i thought oh well there's an order that you wake people in the night so maybe if they fit in within that you know like they would be the good guess. people. Get yeah, I appreciate that all, guess. But, you know, the 11 people get woken. Seeing as you gave me a, a number for 11 and, and zero is invalid, um, and honestly, I don't know, so I think I'm going to have to crowdsource the uh, yeah. information now. That's what I right. always do, yeah, yeah crowdsourcing I've looked it. today three, so I'll see if everyone can, yeah, see what everyone thinks, although some of them will be evil trying to throw spokes in the wheels. But oh, we'll I, think, I find yeah. in this game, even the evil players are on your side and want you to figure it out. So even if you're chatting oh, to the evil really? player, like, they'll often help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay. yeah do, do your yeah. best to like, yeah, think outside the box and think of other options. And I think you're going to get All there. right. Yeah, thank you. Good luck. No evil twin has come first. That there's only a fourth name. Interesting. Okay, yeah, no, that's fair. I mean, I didn't tell anybody that you're the balloonist and now I'm dead, so. Yeah. So, but yeah, yeah, that is my info. Please keep it, uh, my 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 role and info probably to yourself at the moment. Uh, good. I'll probably just yeah. tell Alex, um, but because I, you and her are the only people I've told this. In, um, uh, Alex my uses they them pronouns. Uh, sorry, Alex. I apologize uh, if yeah. you're watching the stream. I apologize. I, I it, incorrectly. Um, so that was my my plan at the moment. Okay. But I wanted to share that with you because you, I have I have trust in you. So. I I appreciate that. Okay. Well, I won't tell what I am because I don't want to tell you what I am. And if there's an OHO out there, but so what That's I am fine. going to do, so here's what I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. I actually know one that you can test that, um, that was given to me. And if you are the OHO, you'd be real dumb to probably hit it <laughs> it's, it's the, because it's the farmer. Farmer. Uh -huh. Okay. Who is and, the farmer? And, and killing the farmer gives another confirmed good towards the final end, and that's probably hundred percent. It's not something the Oho would want to do, and I Never. think Glenn is the farmer. And so, if you choose to try and kill Glenn as the Oho on your head, be it, and you'd have to. I guess. I guess you could keep. <laughs> I guess. I guess you could keep naming farmer through the end of the game. That's maybe a problem. Uh, well, I've already met. Uh, no, you get that power. Hmm. And so, okay, Mer who is Mercer who we executed last night? Uh, that you were not like forthcoming, even though we were both evil, and uh -huh. then you did come out with it after you were like, "Oh yeah, that's right, we're evil." Um, <laughs> but, um, like I, I told him also, like I don't never paid attention to whether you give first night first yeah. day info or not so i was also I like no way idea. too high energy the first day too <laughs> which is always suspicious but yeah. also i was just like excited to be back <laughs> I know. So, all right yep 
put the number and I chose the number two and I was told Payon and Catboy and I just guessed now whether it's to do with the order that people are woken in the night and I was told no. I've tried looking at whether it could be to do with like the actual names, you know, like the letters in people's names and I can't see anything to do with those numbers where that works and um, yeah I just need everyone else's brains to work out what this is so last night you got Ryan and Catboy Pion and Catboy Pion and Catboy yeah okay. and, I, and it was, that was with the number two yeah and then the, the night before that you picked Ryan Terry and who Ridings and Ryan Terry were chosen when I, with the names I was told. When you picked um, 11. 11, yeah. Now, we're assuming Jesse's the drunk, so if that's true, then I'm not. Um, so, this, I suppose I, if there's a poisoner, I could have been poisoned one night. It's hard to that's know. True. I'm not sure. I will have to think about this for a little bit. Um, yeah. Uh, we'll see what happens. All right, sounds good. See ya. Yep, see ya. Uh, amnesiac. Die by town so that in that case, my power wouldn't go off. There's, there's not enough time for that, I don't think, at this point, Alex. I'm sorry. Because I'm so, tomorrow, well, because tomorrow there's going to be so few people. We're not going to have enough. We're not going to have enough time. Yeah. We're not going to have enough time for this plan to go to fruition. As I didn't poison you last night. Who did you point And also, I'm trying to find the demon, and I don't really know that it's... Like, I, two reasons. One, I don't think I have time to poison you and then us to kill you, because then the demon might get another kill, and that might just bring us to another thing. I think I'm better off just trying to poison the live people and trying to windmill slam the demon. Okay, Ryan Terry. Well, at least you now know that I'm not your Yeah, but I, won't, I, I, will, I will discourage town from killing you. That I can do. Okay, cool. Okay, see you later. Bye. All right. I've been telling everyone... Hmm. Don't like we've had two deaths every night. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't feel good. Oh, <laughs> it is still kind of shit. Oh. But one was Godfather, one was Gossip, it seems like. Okay. Hey. The evil team, if yeah. that helps you next figure out what your power is, because they yeah. were claiming to me that they were the cannibal, but then. Thank you, Malachi. I appreciate that. Doesn't line up with. Right. What right. Alex? Said. Yeah, I, wait, Alex claimed cannibal to me as well, but didn't I'm seem to. Cannibal. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't could be lying for that. other reason, but of course, yeah, of course. <sighs> All right, thank oh, you. Yeah. <laughs> um, and so it's just like. With that person being, like, the only one who I've personally told, mm -hmm. I kind of want to use that as just, like, well, you're the only person I've who did, told. Who, 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 who did you tell? Who, who, who are you I told right now? I told Alex, like, and it's okay. kind of, yeah, so, um, what Ryan I got to okay, I have a good vibe on Alex. I don't have such a good vibe on Ryan at the moment. Uh, I can explain that more tomorrow, though. All right. Well, All right. um, yeah. Uh, what is so, so with the balloonist? That means we have. And again, you know what? Oh, to yourself. Uh, don't well, get my intro out. Don't don't share any. I, I really just want, don't. I just. To get I okay. Yeah, I just wanted like. Oh well, yeah. You'll tell everybody, so I don't want you to repeat yourself. Yeah. Okay. All right. See you later. Um, night two. I tested whether I could choose number 47. I was told that was invalid. And I'll tell you the rest. Well, it's that time again. Time to get together and execute one of our neighbors. Yeah. Mm. Uh, yeah. we got to get uh, all back in the circle of trust here. Right. Marissa, did you want Is to it say? a circle of trust? I, I have a thing I want to say to everyone. You've probably all worked out that I'm the amnesiac from my little visits to Theo. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah. We yeah. actually hadn't thought of that at all. Thank you very much. No, I, <laughs> that was a I was thinking about that. I, yeah. I thought yeah. it might be. Yeah. So no. if yeah. you so put your thinking caps on, um, because I can't work this out. Um, I can go and ask another question today. I guess. Uh, so, um, night one, I was told, I'm, I'm asked to pick a number, I chose number three. I was told two names, Micah Draws and Alex. In the day, I guessed whether um, this has to do with the position on the board, and I was told cold. Uh, night two, I guessed number 47 and was told, no, you have to choose a different number. So I chose number 11, and I was given two names, Ridings and Ryan Terry. During the day, I asked whether this was to do with people's abilities working correctly or incorrectly, and I was told cold. Night three, I guessed the number zero and was cho told to choose another number. I chose the number two and was told Pion and Catboy. Uh, during the day, or earlier today, I asked whether... Um, it was, this was to do with the order that people are woken in and was told cold. So, well, please. Well, cold makes this a little bit yeah. hard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was so, about to you know, with, with, ju with just yeah. me and Pion, I Not thought me. it was the different... What? No. Uh, with me and Pion, I thought it was like how many the difference in let, um, numbers of names because it's there's two... Uh, um, yeah, I have two yeah, more Larry. letters than Pion, but that doesn't work for oh, Alex 11. and Micah. No, well, 11, is that, is right. 11 is where I'm, I'm stuck on. I can't yeah, get ideas for three and two, but 11 is where I'm kind of... I tried, you know, I tried try looking doing, at letters. Try names. doing 13, because we have 12 players. Maybe you can't go yeah. over the number of players. Maybe it has to do with that's, the number that's of That's what players. I was thinking, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm assuming yeah. I'll have to stay within the number of players, so if, if I do get the opportunity... I don't die in the night, and I get oh. the opportunity to who, ask. Who is your eleven again? Um, Riding, Riding Ryan Terry. and Ryan Terry. Huh. And I am looking at like, is it the actual letters in the names that people's names start with or finish with, or I mean, that know. probably would be terribly good game info. Yeah, well, it, it might give you who the other team are or something like that if you, you know, I mean... if you worked it out. But I don't think that is it. Yeah. Huh. Well, yeah, um, uh, so, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, open for other things. Uh, Alex. Uh, Marissa, what information were you going to give before you got executed? <laughs> oh, um, I was going to roll drop, and um, I am the fortune teller, mm. which is why I was always very sus of the first few nights, because I don't like dropping that, because the last time I dropped it early, I got murked. Um, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. So when I claim rule, when I when I got I've had fortune teller before, I always start on my side and work my way out and around the circle. And I was going to claim, or not claim, but Catboy and Micah were both zeros and good, so no demons. And then Alex and Glenn, because Jesse had gotten killed that first night, so I had to skip Jesse. Um, also good. And then I got nominated and murked. So I didn't get any other information after that. Demon. Not necessarily good, but at least not the demon. Not demon. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then, yeah, which explains your gossip, I think. And then, and then oh, sorry, Micah, do you want to continue? You want me to, or do you want to? Yeah, this is part of your story too. Okay, uh, I'm the cannibal, so I ate Marissa oh. after she got her head cut off. Um, and then I transcended and saw the prophecy is true. Um, and <laughs> I picked um, Ryan and Helza and got no. So basically, that narrows down the demon to being uh, writings or beardy. You died last yeah. night, right, Micah? Yeah. I disagree I, with that, Micah. Yeah. I think I got the demon. Killed, <laughs> hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got killed last night, but I got woken up last night, which means I'm not the demon kill. Mm -hmm. You mean you can't oh, be the demon kill? Probably the gossip yeah. kill. Gossip King goes Mike before. Uh, gossip okay. goes before fortune teller. Yeah, you shouldn't have woken up at all. You shouldn't have woken last night if you are the cannibal. If I mean, I woke night. up. I don't know what to tell you. I got woken up. I was told to pick two names. I picked Ryan and Helza. I got Who is zero. Then I went to Marissa, huh. 
I had asked her if she was the fortune teller. Odd. She said yes. We compared notes. It's down to Ryan and Beardy as far as uh, Micah. Go. Just remember, if Marissa was evil, you could be drunk as the cannibal and be told anything. That is also true. But and I mean, yes, be- that's true. Uh, but not act. It still should Marissa, act. Let like me just play, say one quick thing. There is a little bit of leeway for storyteller to when when cannibals wake up in the night, uh, based on night order sheets. So, just want to throw that out there. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not the fortune teller. I'm the cannibal. I wake up. Whenever I, I get that, but, at, but if Marissa was not the fortune teller and you as, are the cannibal, they can lie to you about anything. Uh, the I cannibal gets drunk that. information. I yeah, understand that, but true. I'm saying you don't necessarily have the information that, that I have from yeah. Marissa and my own, we've been pretty much able to cross everybody off except for writings and Beardy as the demon. Mm. Also, me, Marissa yeah. was playing fortune teller to me as I died. I, I know. I nominate writings. Okay, let's do it. I think Elsa had her hand up for a question, though. Oh, I'm sorry. No, 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 I don't think so. I think sometimes oh, your hand was up. Sometimes kitties walk across keyboards. Yeah, oh, okay. but it's not. A, yeah, he does. I, it's not. A, I, no, there is it. No. I mean, no. writings. Writings. I've just been getting. I, I've. I've tried to. I think I've tried to do conversations with writings like three or four times, and and have gotten ghosted each time. And <laughs> Fair, I'm sharing like information. With good. People. I'm. I'm. It's felt like he's been ducking me. Um, no, that, that, hmm. that. That. That said, like, um, I don't know. In, in terms of like the amount of info given out, I understand with the Oho like noting the role. Um, I'm not asking that writing's necessarily hard claim, but at, at the same time, we've gotten a couple things on potential sus. I think Beardy's a reasonably safe kill after this, if, if not writing's. Um, and I'm just kind of a little bit... I'm just a little bit sus on it. It's reasonable based off what we have on potential fortune teller info and the fact that he's been kind of ducking my request for private chats a total of three times now it makes me a little bit sus. to be fair i've been in the middle uh, of sharing information with the people that i have information uh, well, if you could. No, and, and, wait, wait, and to be fair and to no, be fair too. i also to be fair i've also been trying to get the writings and i finally and, got to and, him so it's exactly like, it's, like I, I i've been a busy person i've had a lot of people a popular guy writing has shared info with me which, yeah. So, so yeah. basically what you're saying is that the demon's been trying to collect as much info about town as possible no. in order to... To be no. fair, I think, to me, my mm-hmm. evil team, if I had to hard guess right now, Marissa, Ryan, Glenn. That would be my evil team right now, based on the information I've received from town and my own. So uh-huh. Catboy was poisoned night one? All right, well, I'm not sure. Let's go ahead. Depending on how Catboy's- Catboy gave their information out, Ryan could have just repeated it. But I can talk mm. more about that tomorrow. No, I'm, I don't have. I don't have. Theo, a good yeah. Theo, can you confirm that you uh, that Micah got woken up last night? Uh, I can't confirm whether any particular person got woken All up right. last night. Uh, but I, like I said, uh, if there are questions about night order for cannibals, I can say that it's a little bit. I would would like to put pertinent beardy. If I didn't want you to die the other night, I would have not told you not to do that. That's true. Okay, three votes. <laughs> this is for writings. Majority is three. So, give me another day. I promise to tell you everything. Oh, yeah, I've um, heard that before. Wow. Ooh, the three people that you're saying. Three that evils evil that I called out. out. <laughs> oh, no, that's wild. Interesting. I mean... You're, you're just very sus, everything you say. No, right. You're very loudly defensive. Because I think I called... I called. Second call. Um, I don't think that was a good use of the dead boat, Marissa. When we're oh, f- frackle. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Um, I completely forgot about the frackle. Now. <laughs> yeah, it's a fair point. I maybe said that too late. Too late. I... I don't think I am the... I continue to get information. I don't think I would... I think I already have my so world dominate built, somebody I, else. I know. That's yeah. what I'm thinking. I honestly think everyone else is good. So I will put Ryan because also my chat thinks Ryan is evil. <laughs> um, <laughs> All right. Writings, tell us why you and chat think that Ryan is evil. Because based on my information, he would be evil. And I can explain more of that later. But I'm thinking he's either the demon or the minion at this time. 
Why is uh, that always I've actually, later with you? I've actually been running a bit of a. I, I've actually been running a bit of a long thing here. Uh, I, I, should, I should note. Uh, I actually think we 100% should do this. Um, and I say that because my role is the alchemist, and I forgot. And I, I not forgot, but I've actually been noting my set incorrectly here, kind of going through. I'm actually the alchemist goblin. And this is a good kill for ten. Okay. Because if Alchemist Goblin, if Alchemist Goblin dies, then uh, the other, then the uh, then the other team wins. The goblin, and then ah, uh, let's not do this. Then let's kill Glenn. <laughs> because <laughs> if he's the yeah. Goblin, it doesn't matter. Do you have a question? Win, yes. So if we work, we win. Because it's not good. Pion. If a real goblin said that the, the alchemist goblin, does that count as a normal goblin claiming goblin? I'm just claiming goblin. I mean, I'll, I'll say goblin. Yeah, we'll just say... Yeah. Okay, you're fucking evil. Let's That's not true. do this. I'd rather die than us lose to a goblin. <laughs> Three to tie, wait, wait, four to execute. Work? Wait, wait, how does that work? Do you, would people play or don't, or don't, if, if it's an alchemist... Go. If it's an alchemist goblin... Remember the play... Go ahead, Remember, the plague doctor just, died, so um, the minions got new powers, too. I'm just going to say, Ryan Terry did not claim alchemist, but not goblin to me. Right, I noted that. I've been doing a longer set for it. I am, I am alchemist. Um, would someone be willing to nominate Glenn? What, uh, I think you need to kind of accept nominate your Glenn. You, you, Sorry? Helsa, Helsa nominates Glenn. Glenn. Okay, Helsa, tell us what. Uh, I actually don't know anything about Glenn, and I'm <laughs> starting to get an idea. I think, uh, yeah, I, I, I don't think we can. I don't think Glenn's good, so I don't know. I'm not Glenn, saying you've I just been too quiet. <laughs> yeah, Glenn, you've mm. been accused of yeah. being quiet. And... I'm, Tell us what. I'm, I'm just because I'm I'm just the farmer. I don't really have any abilities here, but. Um, no, I, I I mean this just seems like riding, and he does this habitually. He's kind of trapped, and he's just trying to find any way out. I am getting a little bit of a I said I'd rather die than the goblin go get, off. Get rid of writings, and then, and then, I mean, I'd get rid of writings, and then, if you want, get me the next round. Okay. Yeah. So kill me today, yeah. kill you tomorrow? Deal? Can Three to tie, yeah. four to execute. Question? Uh, I also want to say that if they are the farmer, if they did die, that would mean someone else comes the farmer. That would confirm them. That only happens in the night. That only happens in the night. Three to tie, four to execute. Remember, I called out an evil team, and all three of them did that same evil team voted for me. Maybe they just were offended, and we're doing that. I also think Melissa's probably definitely evil since Ryan was decently trying to get them to live. That would explain why uh, the cannibal information is wrong. Two yeah. enough. So I think we have our two minions. Yeah, I think Which Ryan we... and Marissa are probably evil, and then Glenn would be my follow-up, because I trust the other townsfolk at this time with their roles. All right, final call. Is it just because I didn't tell you first? Stop. Are you holding that was a grudge? The big part, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not even to lie a three. Not even to lie a three. That sure. seemed weird. I, I don't three. I don't give information first night and I two. don't kill first night. Air. One and writings. The AI has something to tell you. Excellent. I love the AI telling me something retro. Writings known for <laughs> writings known for his rides so merry, sent on a carousel not so ordinary. Spin your last writings round and round. As the carousel whirls, he's nowhere to be found. Writings is executed and dies. And. Good night. <laughs> dun, dun, da, da. All right. Well, we don't have to worry about who that fourth name is going to be after all. Ooh, it's coming down to it. It is coming down to it. I think Beardy might have something that he wants to do. All right, make sure I'm broadcasting properly here. Um, I haven't caught up with chat in a little while. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wonder what writing's chat sounds like. I hope they're not popping over here to see the grim. Let's go and do our rounds. Starting off with Ryan. Oof, this could be important. 
universe. They're not retconning like a lot. It uh, oh, yeah, that, that could have gone better. Yeah, 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 it's coming down to it. This might be important. Yeah, I uh, no, I I poisoned Beardy. Okay, good luck. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> that's what needed to happen. Glenn, or sorry, Ryan Terry is nothing but an accurate, very well aimed poisoner. Uh, cool. Let's see what else we got to do. Beardy. Hello, Beardy. Hey, Theo. It's getting heated out there. Uh, it is. Oh, I don't have souls. Uh, can I gamble Ryan as the alchemist, please? Yeah, Ryan Terry as the alchemist? Yes, please. All right. Thank you. Good luck. It's going to be interesting. It's going to be interesting. What is Glenn going to choose? Oh, if he chooses Amnesiac, I am. I think he's going to choose Amnesiac, and I'm going to be so sad. I'm going to give him grief if he chooses out. If he chooses Amnesiac, I really am. Uh, as far as he knows, she has no idea what's happening. He didn't see those chats, and she didn't say anything. Okay. All right, please, let's send vibes to Glenn not to choose Amnesiac. That is not his biggest threat, but I don't think he knows what his biggest threat is. Uh, let's see. Uh, that is our next one on our list. All right, Glenn. Well, quite the game, isn't it? Yes, it is. Coming down it's, to uh, it, you skimmed, you you skimmed I, it out of that one by the skin of your teeth, as that, my dad would that, say. I know, I know. So right. I think, um, so I've, I've got two people to choose here, two roles that, but I know who they are. At least I've been told. So I think I'm just going to go for gambler. Okay. All right, I'll take care of it. Okay. Thank Good you. Luck. Well. That's going to be very confusing to Beardy, I'm afraid. That is going to be very confusing. Well, Beardy's not going to know if that was a demon kill or his own death. He's just not going to know. And since it's only death in the night, um, it could go either way. Because that could have been Glenn missing. And I could just let one death happen. Because I get to choose. So, no telling. All right. But we still have Helza. Uh, is there anything before that? Four... Sweetheart's not dead. Uh, I think it's just Helza. Okay. Helza's got this. She's got this. Theo! Helza! All right. Uh, We're all on your team. We're all rooting for number you. Number 17. 17? That's a big number, mm. Helza. But there's only, there's only 12 players around our yeah, little circle here. Um... Let's see. And you learn. Mm. You learn. Morgan and Jesse. Uh huh. Were you That's expecting? Thanks to writings. Oh, do you have a suspicion now? Well, Jesse's number 17 on the character sheet. Uh, or rather. The drunk is number 17 on the character sheet, and I'm pretty sure Jesse's the drunk. Uh, uh, Catboy's number two. Catboy's playing Washerwoman. Washerwoman's number two on the character sheet. So I think one of these two people is that number on the character sheet. Juicy. But I can, yeah, we'll see where we go. Okay, well, if, you, you. if you think you sorted it out, uh, oh. <laughs> I was going to tell her to be careful of the demon. I don't want her to come out and claim and say that she knows. And then the demon just, but it's at the end of the game anyway. It is what it is. Great. Bring it. <laughs> well, while you're playing board games, <laughs> Midnight Strikes and the Barber's Blade, they're caught in a hairy escapade. Shears Ooh. in hand, a trim gone awry. They found them <laughs> shorn, big. no beard to spy. With clippings oh. around, the dawn finds beardies down. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, shit. We're down okay. to four. 
Oh. I need to ask you another question about this complicated game. Oh, yeah. Sure thing. I'm here for all your questions. Oh, mm -hmm. Nope. There we go. All right. Is my ability that the two people I'm told, one of them is in that position of that number on the character sheet? I'm going to say bingo. I'll, I'll read your exact ability. Congratulations. Okay. Thank <laughs> so, you. <laughs> here we go. I'll read it to you. Um, each night. Oh, wait, where's my thing? I can probably do it in my own chat. I think I have it on here somewhere. Uh, here we go. Each night, uh, pick a number. For the corresponding character on the script, if in play, learn two players, one of whom is that character. If not in play, learn arbitrary information. Ah, okay, okay. Thank you. Right. Thank you. I was lucky then. <laughs> yeah, all right. Congratulations. I was going to tell her again. I was going to tell her again. Ah, to be careful. But then I immediately died in it. <laughs> because. No, I think it's easy for us. It could I have mean, been something be else too, and now have the goblin power once you died. Uh, True, but I mean, like, there's no way they're not. There's no way they're good because even if you were an alchemist goblin, you'd, you'd be never telling that. that. Never yeah, thought you would have said that from the get. Um, um so I'm I'm gonna question, I, as I was quick question for Theo. Okay. Um, oh, he's here. Let's say, let's say Ryan. Let's say if someone was a Scarlet Woman who picked up the goblin ability thanks to a plague, Doctor Death. And then they become the demon. They because they're no longer a minion, they'll lose the goblin ability, right? Right. So they can't be a demon with a goblin ability. Right. Yeah. Cool. Great. Um, good to know. So Pion, what I was telling Beardy, because I don't mind sharing the information to you, because I think you're good. Um, I am I the agree. balloonist, and you were my first name. I got. Uh, I got you, then Ryan, then Alex. Um, you Ryan, then Alex. Here's yeah. the thing. I think that means Alex is a good because I'm an outsider as plague. Yep. So I'm yep. an outsider. Alex is probably good. Ryan's probably the minion. I definitely think we have to kill Glenn. Like yeah, I know Glenn has like, to live. We need to kill Glenn. Ryan yesterday yeah. asked and me. And that was the gamble. same three that Yeah, and that was the three that voted to execute me yesterday. Ryan yeah. yesterday asked me to gamble Glenn as the farmer. Uh, I chose not to. I chose to gamble Brian as the alchemist. Yeah. Uh, there was only one death last night, so I was probably a demon kill. And with Ryan claiming goblin, demon kill. With Ryan claiming goblin, I think he's more likely the minion. But also, not to meta Theo, I think it's more likely he would give me the <laughs> demon, the demon for last. Out of a, a you don't a know me. Form. You don't know me. <laughs> Also, no, I, 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 and I trust the rest of the people for what their claims are. So that just really leaves me Glenn. Mm -hmm. and, and that would make yeah. perfect sense if they get you as the gambler to say Glenn, and then they kill you anyway. It's like, ooh, did your gambler go off? Ooh, we can and that puts Glenn. us the final three too at that point. Yeah, and yeah. and it's the other thing that uh, we definitely can't kill Ryan no matter what. Yeah, Alex, so that's everything we go into Glenn. I think if we go into tomorrow, if we're at four now, if we go into to sleep, I think Glenn and Ryan will be alive and it'll be Helzer or Alex left. I agree. Yeah. I think both Helzer and Alex are good. Yeah. yeah if you can take the hit, right, and you uh, die, and then I kill the sweetheart, and we've oh. won. What's that? We should probably not be talking this long at the end. Yeah, okay. okay. All right. Cannot be trusted. Hello. No. Hello. We're hello. just talking about um, how Glenn cannot be trusted, and okay. writing is definitely up to some shit because the yeah. stuff he told me does not add up if Alex is what they say they are. <laughs> exactly. Ooh, but Beardy also claimed to me that he was the gambler. Maybe he gambled wrong. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, yeah well, writing's thought that. Beardy could be the gambler. Yeah, well, Beardy asked me <laughs> if he gambled me if he'd be right or wrong, and I'd be like, don't gamble me, don't die. Um, so I wanted to protect him. Um, I don't know if Marissa is actually the fortune teller. I don't know, but like, but Micah also says that he got it. So. Okay. Yeah. I know. Right. 
uh, Catboy is Catboy and Pion. One of them is the Washerwoman, and Pion's been Catboy's been claiming that all along. Uh, Micah draws an Alex. One of them is the grandmother. Okay. Which uh, I think Micah said more or less. All right. Cool. Uh, yeah. I want to let you know. I yeah, balloonist. My pings were Pion, Ryan, and Alex. Um, I think Ryan Pion was our outsider, as they claim plague doctor. Alex is our town. So that leads. Beardy, what's your role? I told you my role on day one. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna. Did you? Did you? Did you do it wrong? <laughs> Did you just like, there's only one kill there's only one death and so I might have died to my own ability and then the demon killed me anyway you were, I, 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 I got, you I got a bingo guys I got I a bingo oh yeah how's that <laughs> tell us yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I got a bingo so um, oh. thanks to writing's suggestion I looked at char- people's characters positions on the sheet so basically my ability is each night pick a number for the corresponding character on the sheet learn two players if no if that character is not in play learn arbitrary information but i think characters were in play for all of them so night one number three that character is grandmother i got micah jaws and alex um i believe it's micah what? Night two, it's eleven. Yeah, um, eleven is the alchemist. I got riding some Ryan Terry, oh. and Ryan's been claiming that. Night three, I chose number two, which is the washerwoman. I got Pion and Catboy. Catboy's been claiming washerwoman all along. Um, and then I, last night, I chose number seventeen because I was testing this theory out, and I that is the the. Um, Drunk, I got Jesse and Morgan. And Jesse, as we know, is the drunk. We're pretty sorry on the drunk. And <laughs> we're pretty, I gambled Jesse as the drunk and didn't die. So, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, there you go. So I can, also, I can also note something and come clean a little bit on, on a deception to town. Here, I noted the goblin a second ago because I didn't want to get killed last night. I am the alchemist, to confirm Hell's note uh, from the earlier check. Um, but I, I am the alchemist poisoner not the alchemist goblin i did the goblin so you wouldn't kill me so a bit deliberately to throw a thing out there that nobody would want to vote for the Mm -hmm. the reason i i did goblin is because i've been trying to figure out who the demon is and do various poisonings to Mm -hmm. different folks because if i can poison the demon they won't get a kill and i have been missing thus far (laughs) um Mm -hmm. i uh, last last night i hit beardy and he died, so obviously it wasn't Beardy. I'd, ar- I'd already tried, and I also tried Morgan. Morgan didn't die. Uh, that was the night that Morgan ended up getting killed. I think that was getting killed by the demon. Ultimately, I tried myself the first night because I didn't want to accidentally hit somebody and hit first night information. And then because I didn't have any good data, the other night I hit Catboy uh, after he'd already given away Washerwoman uh, because I knew that he was a safe poison without me hurting anyone. And I didn't want to mess up anyone's stuff. So, um, I, but the but last night, um, yeah, I, I hit Beardy. I was planning on hitting um, either, which, whichever we don't kill of Alex or Glenn, I can poison. Uh, and then that will basically give us a guaranteed other night. Or I can hit, or if we don't want to take that shot... I can poison either Alex or Glenn, and if someone dies, namely me, we kill whoever is still a, like we kill the one that I know didn't come back. Is another way for town to. But should we off. not kill? Since it's four people, should we not kill someone though? We should not, the- not kill tonight because there's four. If, if we kill, on if four, you think if you think there's no, if we haven't killed all any of the evil, then I, I would say vote. If you think that we have, then we probably can go to a final three. It just makes, it's going to just be two evil and one townsfolk left at that point, though. In the, good words, oh, sorry. in the good words of Ryan Terry, um, nominations are our strongest, like, power <laughs> as a town. And so I 
I don't like leaving it just for the demon to kill. I think this is like the time where we have a lot of like alive folks. Well, we have exactly one kill left, full stop, Alex, one way yeah. or the other. We, like, we, we, we should have exactly yes. one execution left, regardless. So, I, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, Alex, we don't get another one if, if we miss. I mean, if Alex is, I mean, Alex should play, have played a complete banger on me and I've been snowed. But otherwise, I, I'm pretty sure the demon's Glenn. I think, I think I, so yeah. too. Jesse, are we? Are the nominations open or not, not yet? yet. Je, let me go to Jesse and then Glenn and then we'll do that. Jesse? I'm just trying to make sense of Marissa's read of neither Alex or Glenn being the demon. Could have been. Because she's evil. All right. Yeah. <sighs> that would. Uh. <laughs> I, I, I was trying to think of that. Yeah. We know one of Marissa or Micah have to be have Here, here's, false information here. or lying because their information said together that either writings or I are the demon. We're both dead. Here's uh, the other dead. thing. No, I got it. I'm back. There is a goblin. There's just straight up a goblin because I, yeah. But... If, if 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 so, there's no evil twin because no one's come forward. I died as the plague mm -hmm. doctor. No evil twin can be made. If you are the poisoner, right? In that you got that's not in play. And there's two minions. I, that means it's Godfather, Goblin, and Scarlet Woman. That's well, no one's claiming Goblin, so well, there's probably you have to think about what the Theo became. Jesse, so I am. Oh, sorry. I was just saying we have to think about what Theo became. <laughs> Nominations are open. Yeah, I, I'm oh. just saying that oh, in total, you know, those are the abilities. Micah and Glenn have their hands up. I, I wanted but Glenn. Yeah. I, I actually I want to nominate Ryan. His story has just changed so many times. I don't believe he's the goblin. I don't believe he's a lot of things. So it's very suspect to me. Oh, okay, I'm I'm the goblin, so don't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, have, along with everything else, right? Okay, is two votes to be put on the block? Here we go. Whether he's goblin or not, this is a horrible idea. Mm -hmm. I'll be curious to see if well, yeah, but everybody claims on. Goblin, don't they? Well, I mean, like, it's a horrible idea because if we kill him, the game's over. Uh, well, literally, if he's okay. Goblin or not, the game ends no matter what if he dies. Well, but we also have a lot of things that mean if we do this, I nominate Glenn. Glenn. Is over. I have okay. Alex nominates Glenn. Alex, sorry. Oh, wait, no, I'm no. the Goblin. <laughs> Apparently, everybody could well, just say I'm goblin and everybody gets scared. Let me give it to That's Alex first. Silly. Alex? Sure. I, was I going to hear Micah? Micah, were you going to say something? No, I typed it in chat. Okay, cool. So, yeah, sorry, writings. I had to tell you something different, um, but I did tell Ryan Terry my real role, and um, Ryan hasn't killed me, so there's that. Um, oh. And we tried to make a whole plan. That's the same um, role you told me? Yeah, it's the same role I told you, Jesse. Um, but I, I have no reading on Glenn. Glenn, like, hasn't given me anything in a three for three. It's very convenient to claim farmer when, like, at, at night you haven't died. You haven't been a target yet. Uh, you haven't proffered any information that's helpful for town. And so I, I feel like if we're going for a demon, like, I'm get, getting, like, a, a read from Helza being, like, the, the true amnesiac getting help for the info i'm getting a read from ryan terry being this alchemist uh being confirmed by catboy and so this is the, just my reading of the of the grim and so glenn i have nothing on you and i would like to kill you right away to win the game <laughs> i think we i think honestly part of the reason i noted goblin i think any kill tonight is a bad idea yeah. glenn? Glenn? Uh, i mean i think i stated my case i don't glenn? i mean i don't have anything to go against me um, you know, did somebody you, else would be the farmer. Did you actually say you were the goblin? Are you claiming goblin? No, I'm not. I'm, I was he just was pointing out that everybody just says I'm the I goblin. Am, I am I goblin. I am all goblins. We, we are somebody okay. claims we're that because that's like. I'd like to note one more thing that Helza, your first point of information being the grandma is wrong. Neither my co Yeah, or yeah, my yeah, 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 yeah. I kind of can be yeah. arbitrary. Yeah. Uh, but if, if I choose a number where the character's not in play, I get arbitrary information. So, yes. Oh, that's, yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody makes sense. else have anything to say before I run this? Okay, I was, no then. Yeah. Yeah. Unless you're absolutely certain that Glenn is the demon, you probably shouldn't do this. Sure. If there's any doubt that you think it might be Ryan, 
You might want to well, go till tomorrow. Well, I feel it. Damon. Okay. I, well, there's a think... possibility where your alchemist read was also arbitrary, and Ryan Terry's not the alchemist. Either, 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 yeah, yeah, I mean, we gotta run this. That's my alchemist in play, yeah. Okay. Either, yeah. either way, <laughs> we can go to okay. final three. There's no reason to kill yeah. when we can wait one more night and then have an actual final three. All right, yeah. two goes to be put on the block. Didn't Ryan Terry ask the alchemist, though? The demon can't win if we don't vote. We can go to final three without any worry. I think trying to kill someone's knight is very suspicious. I, I, I hold, I stand. I'm a person of my word. Okay, just not enough. That. Final call. Five, four, three, two, one. And the AI has fallen silent, as has the town. Everyone goes to sleep. We killed Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I, as far as Glenn goes, Glenn is a very straightforward kind of guy. And I think that when it comes to some of the deception stuff, he's learning how to do it. And I think it's getting better, but it's still, I think it's just difficult for him. It's against his nature. And so he struggles with that kind of thing. Ryan Terry, on the other, on the other hand, and our buddy Eric, who isn't here, they can rip a town apart. Uh, it's, well, there's quite a few other people at this particular table, but uh, that's what made this little team very interesting. All right, so we're down to it, but Helza, yeah, I think Glenn really has to kill Helza at this point. Um, but let's see. Well, Ryan Terry's going to poison her anyway, so. Hello. Hey, Theo. I, I, what's the button for Night Order? Uh, Chad, if you remember the number for Night Order, let me know. Let me pull it up, though. Um, shortcuts. Night Order is O. Oh, okay. Oh, as an O. Oh. Yeah, but you generally go first. Okay. Um, I poison Glenn. Okay. All right. I'll take care of it. Is happening. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Bring up a fifth one. Hello. Well, I was surprised to survive, but uh, tonight it'll be the sweetheart. Sweetheart, it is. All right. Good luck. Okay. Bye. Bye. Oh my god. That would have, like, Alex is the only one who has any sus on them. And I think just a, just a little bit of sus. So we gotta get rid of Helza or possibly Ryan Terry, but yeah. Uh, yeah, that's uh, good poisoning there. I think that would have been a bad choice. Um, but yeah, interesting. Uh, Ryan Terry is going to poison Alex tonight, I assume. And that will be that. <laughs> See, I told you, Ryan Terry's got this under wraps. That's brilliant. But Helza does get accurate information. All right, hey, Helza, hey. you're still alive. <laughs> yeah, I, sh I am. I'm surprised. I should have asked everyone. What I should guess. Um, I will choose number twenty, please. Number twenty. Okay. You choose number twenty. Do you know what that is on your chart? It's the goblin. Okay. You learn. Oh. Ryan Terry. Yeah. Glenn. Oh. Glenn. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no worries. It's tricky. <laughs> Thank you. Thank Good you. luck. Bye. Swinton. It's like the, the voice of the train. Yeah. It was Mr. Wilford. Yep. Who was like the creator? Yeah, yeah. And who was Sean Bean? <laughs> no, the creator is our AI overlords who oh, no. have again fallen silent. Oh, have... Damn it! Yes. No, guys, this is great news. Got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. 
Um, like I said, I'm the alchemist poisoner, and I poison, and I figured out who the demon is. Uh, oh, I, yes. I, I, I successfully. Or, I successfully poisoned the demon. And who yeah. do you who? think the demon is, Ryan? Who did you poison? The demon is Alex. Right. <laughs> yeah. Or right. A kill. Or you could have actually poisoned your demon, Glenn, and went na na na, and just he <laughs> didn't get to kill last night. Right, so you can oh, make this pitch. Here's my thing: I, it's either we make this game go longer and <laughs> get down to an actual final three, or we take Ryan's word for it. Yeah, I, I asked a question last oh, night. Sure. I, I didn't know what to ask. I should have asked you guys what to ask. And you should I should ask the demon. <laughs> well, I don't yeah. know which demon, but which demon? Um, I, I don't know which. Oh demon. ho. So I asked. I think, I asked I'm Goblin. thinking it's likely to be an OHO. Let Helsa finish. I, I asked Goblin because we, you know, and of course I got Ryan, Terry, and Glenn because they both claimed Goblin. So we, <laughs> it, was, it didn't help us at all. <laughs> Which is smart of Theo. Okay. I see you, Theo. Yeah, yeah, I know. I, I, yeah. <laughs> we're not going to have. Yeah. Any, <laughs> we're not going to have any more <laughs> demon kills. Like yeah, I'm, I'm happy. I, well, I mean, I, 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 in, in, uh, Theo in. Theo, in the world where a demon then consistently does not kill at Final Four, how would you rule it? Because there are precedents already in play for that. I mean, if, if the town refuses to kill as well, we just go to a fiddler. Right. Okay. What's a what fiddler? Well, uh, how I about this? I nominate Alex. I know Alex is the demon. Uh, well, we haven't oh. gotten the nominations yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Sorry. How about this? I, I have an idea. We can sure. go, if we really need, we can go one more night. If you are indeed fact the poisoner, you can poison the demon again, and then Helza can just ask for the oh ho, oh, oh ho, and get between two people. And yeah. they'll get Alex and Glenn probably. Yeah, yeah, uh, that's what you would do. Like, yeah, yeah, that's what will happen. Why don't, it's always between two. Yeah, it's always between yeah. two. So I don't think that would help us. Quick, yeah. Not at all. Explain that again. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not following that. Because we're if suspecting I, you and Alex as the demons, yeah. so I'm a little, I'm a little yeah, sus of what writings need to private chat about right now. <laughs> I don't know yeah. what they're more in their private. Um, chat about. right. They're I out. could say it because writings put it in public announcement that he's the balloonist. Morgan said that his balloonist claims don't make sense based uh, on what um right. writings well, told Morgan. Oh, interesting. Okay. His balloonist claims is he got me. Alex and Ryan. I'm the outsider, so that means Ryan's a townsfolk or evil. So basically, one between Ryan and Alex, one of them's evil. I do think I want to trust Ryan for the one reason that Helza said alchemist and got Ryan. And I yeah, feel like but, okay. But, so we're talking about Ryan claimed not alchemist demons. publicly by that point. So we're talking about not demons, and yeah. so I can have a lot of people in this group also confirm that I've been in their kings for not. Yeah. All right. Welcome yeah, back. Been... Real quickly, I want to uh, thank you to uh, NS Nick and chat for giving us the quote of the fiddler. So this is what happens when it comes to a stalemate in a game, which we haven't had yet here at the Gallant Goblin. Uh, a Ooh. fiddler is a fable that I can bring in that says once per game. Oh, thank you for the follow. Once per game, the demon secretly chooses an opposing player. All players choose which of these two players win. So it forces a show a showdown in town square. So that's what we'll do. If Bring we... on the fiddler! <laughs> it would end. It would end up being. It would end up being like you and somebody else, either me or Alex. Alex. Yeah, Alex. You are you going to hard play? claim anything at this point? Sure. Um, so hello. Here's my story. So I went around telling everyone that I was a cannibal. I'm not a cannibal. I just didn't want to die because, like, my interactions would be so bad with the whole of town. So I'm actually the sweetheart. Um, and I didn't want to die so, so that people, like, I didn't drunk anyone. And so I did tell a couple people that I had lied. And then I told people that I was the sweetheart. And we were trying to figure out which demon I was, which minion. And again, I'd like to point out to everyone else that there are good pings out there that say I'm not the demon. And so we want to go out and not do this. What are the good pings, Alex? Let's say that well, you're not the deal. Yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I got think... a good ping too, so... Well, let, let, let me, let, I, I asked Alex a question. Could I please hear her and day's so, response? I do believe, who was it? I was not in the ping. It's either Marissa or Micah that said I was not the demon in one of oh, their, like, fortune teller. It Micah. It was Marissa. Marissa. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't, no, that, 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 that I, I, I just credit, but... Um, 
Uh, what about was? Hmm. What's right. our outsider count? If you're three. three, it this could be three, three because I'm the balloonist. Mm, Actually, nice. yeah. Okay, yeah. so oh, I also uh, don't care about dying. I'm actually the sweetheart. I'll drunk someone up. I told Ryan Terry that you should that he could poison me so that if I do get killed, then I, no one. I, would I, be drunk. It is line. also possible that the demon sunk a kill. Yeah, I actually am yeah. more inclined to believe you, Alex, now, because if I go off that information, I, it makes me think Ryan lies about one of their poisoning choices. Mm -hmm. I, I, I do have what one is issue with that. We'd have to assume there's three outsiders then, because that would be me, Jesse, and Alex. Could yeah, and there's a balloonist. Oh, there's a balloonist. There's probably a godfather. Or could also, or this or could also be a writer. There's one to five. Writing's throwing a catamount in regards to... Do keep in mind... There's a sentinel in play as well. A sentinel, there might be one extra or one fewer outsider in play. Outsiders in play. That's okay. true. Mike, so outside I, are Brian, are Brian, I mean, for me, the big part of why I think you're now evil is the whole, the, the literally your team, the, I call it who I think my evil team is. They Those three then vote on me and spend a dead vote to do it. Oh, that was just because I forgot. That, <laughs> that, uh, I, 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 give, I give you more trust than that, Marissa. I don't think oh, that no. was the... I don't think right. that was a nomination. The day's getting ready to end, and we need to do a nomination. Nominations are open if you want to do them. Uh, and yeah, so I'd also like to put it out there that I told, like, I my one of my first conversations. All right, I nominate was, Alex. I'm ripping this Band-Aid off. Okay, let me let Alex finish their statement first, though, real fast. Yeah. Alex, by all means. Sure. But time is ticking um, down, and we well, have to Well, the time, time stops when the uh, vote comes up. Okay, so I also wanted to tell everyone that I also told Beardy that uh, I was the cannibal, and then he's just like, "Should I gamble?" You know, I was like, "No." <laughs> so like, he knew I was the cannibal. Uh, that is that, that is yeah. what happens. You like, I'm cannibal. I'm like, yeah. Can I gamble? I also that? wanted <laughs> to save Beardy, um, so I am a good character because I didn't want Beardy to die to like gamble my character because <laughs> of my like false claim. Okay, the Brian Terry, the accusation now. Yeah, I again, I, we're never going to get another kill, so we can technically do this until the cows come home. But, um, but yeah, ultimately, Alex, who I poisoned last night, we didn't end up having a death. Uh, I suspect it was because they tried to grab me on Alchemist, or uh, maybe Glenn on Farmer, or possibly Helza on uh, Helza on Amnesiac, and uh, it ended up not working because they were poisoned. Uh, I go first as as a uh, alchemist poisoner so i can i can keep alex locked down for as many times as we want to do this but ultimately we'd go to fiddler but yeah uh this is this is the demon we can go from here alex um so hello everyone thanks for tuning in um so i'm not i'm just here like like innocent girl next door, sweetheart who wears a ribbon in her hair. Um, and uh, Ryan Terry, I mean, like, I think, I feel like I've been acting like town folk to everybody, pretty much claiming, helping people. And I still believe Glenn is our demon. I feel like our demon just sunk the kill. Um, but if you kill me, I'm okay with that too, because then that means that like no one's drunk. But also like I don't, I didn't like I I suggest that we kill on a night four, and also like bring on the fiddler if we can't bring it. But like I'm also okay dying. But also like, do we want to sleep on it? See if it, like we can get to the fiddler. All right. The uh, it's it's worth it's worth noting, and this is a bit of a, on a demon thing. I've I've noted this a couple of times, Alex. We can't sink a kill on you, and then it not matter. Like if. If it goes to if it goes to three, theoretically, the demon could kill. And yeah, that was two votes. So, oh, yeah, like, if we kill the wrong person. Yeah, uh, hey, go ahead. I just vote we vote for someone soon because I've really got to pee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's three, so technically evil cannot do it. Okay. I like to nominate Glenn, the real demon in this household. Tell us more, Alex. <laughs> Okay, so I've been pretty much like sweetheart. Glenn, you're claiming like what? Farmer, goblin, you haven't died yet. Like what's happening? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, you nominated me last time and everybody says, okay, let's just don't keep it. Because you thought you were going to go to a three. Anything else uh, you want to add, Glenn? Um, no, I mean, it's the same thing. I've got i mean i think the others are being very sus but um i mean i don't really have anything to add to this you know 
Okay. So. Three votes to tie, four to execute. Mm -hmm. This is... Well, yeah. chance that we got to do something. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, I'm. It's if Ryan. it's not Glenn and it's Ryan, then it might game. be Ryan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ryan. it might be Ryan. Okay. okay. Uh, I, think, I don't think, I think it's Ryan. Ryan. Because if it was Ryan, someone else would have claimed Goblin. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just really curious to see what this Grim looks like. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah me too. It, like, it, was was so good. it can be tied but not problem. beaten. Does anybody else want to nominate? Okay. We can't beat it. Hells, are you nominating? No. Okay. Uh, who else? Uh, Glenn, are you nominating? Uh, no. Okay. How, then... how, how <laughs> sure are you that we're the alchemist? Mm. Well, with that in mind, the AI not... wakes up. <laughs> and... So I'll call him five, four, yeah. three, two, oh, no, okay. one. Um, so, no, 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 Glenn, Glenn, the pilot Glenn. must fly once more with wings too big from folklore. Glenn's last glide, the villagers cheer. As he vanishes, they shed a tear. Glenn is executed and dies. And the game is effectively over. And congratulations go to the good team. Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right, congratulations. <laughs> oh my god. Let's I was like 95% so sure it was Glenn. I was like, there's a 5% world Alex yes. snowed me hard. <laughs> no, it had to be Ron. <laughs> Ooh, there are a lot of ups and downs there. Let's start with, uh, I, I want to start with Helza, our amnesiac, who got a bingo, I think, on day Good four. Good job. Which is hey. Hey. Helza. Helza's ability oh, was... Um, it was Ryan. Good job, writings. Yeah. Oh, you want, to be fair, I have my script to the side so I can remember everything every time I play. So sure. when you said it didn't work on placement, I was like, maybe the script? Because it was yeah, just yeah. staring at yeah, me. Yeah. So um, how is this ability? Pick a number for the corresponding character on the script. Or so each night, pick a number from the uh, for the corresponding character on the script. If in play, learn two players, one of whom uh, is that character. If not in play, learn arbitrary information. And yeah, so Ooh. Helza was able to use that to help, uh, being Beardy helped with this as well, to help confirm that Jesse was indeed our drunk, uh, yeah. who tried to be confirmed early on, but was unfortunately murdered. Yeah, Jesse, um, your liver was delicious, though. <laughs> <laughs> Micah, you've been the cannibal too many times. A little yeah. Chianti with it. Um, we had Jesse. We had Morgan, who was our gossip indeed, uh, who gossiped. Uh, what was your first gossip? What was your first gossip? Was that, was that an the Oho? demon is an Oho? That the demon was an Oho, and indeed, Glenn was our Oho. Your second ah, gossip was yeah. that maybe a little less important. That, there is no. A nope. grandmother, and I shouldn't have done that because there wasn't a grandmother. <laughs> no grandmother in play. That's when I decided <laughs> our gossip is, might be getting a lot of people killed, so we probably need to take kill off our gossip. Um, Thank you. That's uh. completely fine. We had Beardy, who was indeed our gambler. I don't know if Beardy is still there or not. Beardy, you there? I'm here. Okay, excellent. I'm here. Uh, Beardy gambled everything correctly at the list to start uh, that. Pion was indeed our plague doctor. Uh, and we'll talk come back to that in a second. Who was your second uh, gamble there, Beardy? Uh, uh, my Jesse second the drunk? gamble was Jesse the Drunk. Jesse the Drunk, double confirmed. And your third one? Uh, Ryan as the alchemist. Ryan as the alchemist. And we'll come back to that in a second. Um, <laughs> <laughs> We did indeed have Micah Draws as our cannibal who got the abilities of who was executed during the day. Hi. Yeah, we had Marissa. Our, Marissa. Oh, Jesse, yeah. our drunk. So yeah, <laughs> nothing there. And then Marissa, our fortune teller. Oh, wait, no. Ooh, Marissa, you can scare the woman a lot. Uh, I do. As often as Micah gets cannibal. <laughs> yeah. So I went through the motions uh, with Micah for uh, the fortune teller, but there was a—I'm not sure if it was a mistake or not. Uh, waking Micah, I—I I think when I put the token down on Marissa, it put him in the night order where the Scarlet Woman usually goes, uh, as opposed right. to where the fortune. So that's where I made that mistake. That makes sense. But uh, it didn't yeah. end up affecting anything because the information was poisoned anyway and didn't really help or hinder anything. So <laughs> that's why I didn't want y'all to base any decisions on Micah based on my little issue of night order. So I tried to squash that as best I. 
could. We had writings, our balloonist. Uh, writings, you want to give us your names? Uh, Pion, Ryan, Alex. All right. So, yeah, uh, you got Pion, first off, as our outsider. Um, and from then on out, you were poisoned by Ryan Terry, our regular non-alchemist-related poisoner, uh, who, first of all, poisoned Catboy, our washerwoman. You oh, my- little... <laughs> <laughs> you wash the clothes of a poisoner, you get what you get. <laughs> you need to lay off the bottle, son. You need to lay off the bottles. Brian Terry <laughs> nailed every single poison in this game, getting the wow. nailing the washerwoman on day one. So I told Catboy the alchemist was either Ryan Terry or somebody else. Or I don't remember who. Um, who did I tell you, Catboy? Yeah, writings. Uh, and yeah. then uh, writings, you just start, you got pretty arbitrary information. You got Ryan Terry as the demon. Uh, <laughs> and, that worked. And you got and Alex, Alex. Uh, as the outsider, I think. No, no, it's a minion. You got Alex as the minion. Who wasn't either? It yeah, worked from, it, oddly enough, worked with the information I had because Alex told me that they were the cannibal. So when yeah. I'm looking yep. at this information, I'm like, outsider. Minion demon townsfolk. So yeah. for me, Ryan was locked immediately. Even though that poisoning was to mess me up, it really made me tunnel on Ryan as either the minion Yay. or the demon. Wild. Catboy. Yeah, Ryan, Ryan, Ryan Terry. Ryan Terry. I just have to ask, why me? <laughs> I, was, I, was, I, was, I was trying. Uh, Theo can actually corroborate this. I, I was, uh, and you'll, you'll see it on the on the stream back. I was like, eh, I should probably poison writings day one just in just in case because I know he knows a lot about this script. But then, but then, uh, math. But then, to but be then fair, math, that would be. Oh my, uh, I was, and I was like, oh, cat! I should poison cat boy. Cat boy day one. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Who it's said just, like entertaining? It's just, it's just respect. Cat, it was, it, it's a random thing, regardless, and so. I just yeah, did it off oh. a joke because mask jumped up on my leg. And, and I had a cat uh, and I'm also, like, one cat boy. I should and also so point I, out that uh, Ryan Terry poisoned Beardy, uh, I believe, on the night when Beardy gambled Ryan as the alchemist. Uh, but yeah. Glenn then yep. killed the gambler in the night. And then yeah. Ryan Terry poisoned Glenn uh, to keep yep. a, <laughs> a, a death from going through. Um, because Glenn as the Oho, the Oho doesn't really have the ability to sink a kill, uh, which I don't know if really got discussed much. Uh, mm-hmm. So even if Glenn True. wanted to sink a kill, he doesn't have the option of doing that because if it, he well, does, does actually. Yeah, yeah. 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 I tried. To, I was trying I to really get that play. No things at the end. It didn't end up working, but I was they trying can, to make it play. Yeah, I, no, a play that's yeah. already dead. Like they can pick Plague Doctor again, oh. and then it's yeah. yeah. into a dead. That's true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Well, but like play. Marissa, when question: I, Was what, did you spend your go by accident, or were you really working to try to take me out? Oh, no, that was absolutely an accident. I forgot I was dead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was like, mad respect. Yeah, boy. <laughs> I was... Glenn, Glenn, wh- I was... Um, so yeah. how many... Because I know if you guess a role that is not in play, it's an arbitrary death, right? Oh, no, yeah, but I was I, I got them all. So... Yeah, like, was just, I was, that was but, my question, yeah. I did Plague Doctor, then I did Cannibal. Again, trying to get who's the most effective players. And so from, oh, and then from the game. When Pion died, uh, yeah, Ryan Terry gained the Goblin ability. That's right. So was oh, I... I'm, gl- I'm, I'm glad I was like, please don't vote for this no more. Yeah, yeah, right yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's How just did say, I die? Well, uh, sorry, Catboy? How did I die? Uh, gossip. That's what I thought. Because uh, I fucked up. Yeah. Morgan <laughs> ended up dying to her own gossip. Cheers yeah, I to. I, 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 I would kill the plague doctor on a gossip. <laughs> cheers yeah, no. to uh, writings, real fast. I want to give three cheers to writings. One, for sussing out the evil team pretty early on. Uh, two, yeah. for writing this really fun script that we all had a lot of fun with today. And three, for yeah, helping Helza figure out that amnesia ability. Y'all work together as Thank a good you. team on that. And y'all solve yeah. that together. Yeah. 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 I just fumbled into Marissa. I stumbled into that. <laughs> um, um, but when the three of them voted to have me executed that really just solidified that triangle for me yeah yeah, yeah. jesse yeah, that well, was awesome i just i don't understand the plague doctor 
Yeah, so when the plague doctor dies, the storyteller gains a not in play minion ability, and there's a lot of different jinxes and things that go along with this. So I could have taken the godfather ability, in which case I could have killed somebody when an outsider dies. Um, but there's uh, jinxes at the bottom of the script that you can look at. I decided to do the goblin one because I thought it was the most fun. And so another in play minion gains a goblin's ability. And so Ryan Terry also gained, on top of the poisoner ability, the goblin ability. Mm. Oh. So, I think so that, I think that's the true. What's yeah, that? I was, I was trying to go through and like maybe even go through with the idea on on demon, maybe throwing it towards myself, but like, um, ultimately, yeah, I, don't, I don't know why. Why wouldn't if you knew you were the goblin? Why wouldn't you have tried to get people to kill you and then? You still would have to claim yeah. goblin though. Yeah, no, I'm saying totally claim goblin fine. and then make it really sussed on yourself. Then, 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 oh yeah, yeah, I mean, I was, we were already going all, all in on my kind of on on the information set, and I had claimed goblin. Yeah, I think I, if you I, had done I, goblin at the very beginning, like, hey guys, I'm the alchemist goblin. Let's go for the equivalent of a mayor win, and try to pitch mm -hmm. it that world from the like day one. I think it yeah. could have swung. I don't think I would have gone for it, but I could have seen <laughs> Ryan. No, convince I, I don't think this won. town probably would have done that. Realistically, I, I think, started to uh, think Glenn wasn't the demon when, when Glenn, when you didn't nominate Ryan, like w when you said, "Oh no, no, I don't have anything to say." I thought, "Well, you're just giving up." You're the demon, like as we were, as we were winding up, and it was too late for me to nominate, say Ryan. I was, I was thinking, "Oh, actually, surely, if Glenn is the demon, he would, and Ryan's the minion, he would nominate Ryan." Um, but he didn't. He did so. nominate Ryan. Oh, he did. Last night. Oh, he did. Oh, see, I'm not taking not last night. Last, last night, he did not. Yeah. No, no last up. night. Like, well, it went when no. he, when he was on the block. You were on the block. We need a. We I, need I know, a but at that point, yeah. uh, there were so many votes. Quick. There weren't enough votes to get him. Let we can, say, hey, we can still talk, but yeah. we need to end stream. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. I, thank you, Catboy. Yeah, 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 I'm just going to go ahead and say, y'all can hang out and chat, but I'm just going to say good night to everybody who's watching. Thank you all for playing with us. Uh, it was a pleasure. Bye. We're going to go ra raid Maddo Cat now. And you can check Ridings is doing a uh, version, uh, a player perspective version of this game that you can check out later to see cool. how Ridings cool. sorted all this out. So go check that out yep. at Hitless it's Video on, on YouTube. Yep, it's on my Twitch right now. I did stream this one, and I will have this eventually on YouTube. Awesome. Very good. So Thank you all. Don't forget um, Micah's uh, Kickstarter and uh, real soon. What's it called again, Micah? Uh, the Monster Men and Men of Urban Fantasy Coloring Book. Yes, if you like sexy menses and you like coloring, you go to that place and you're going to have a good, good. time. They Mike do is look a good. great artist. They're very attractive. All right. Good job. <laughs> good night, everybody. Has to go. We're going to go raid Maddo Cat, and y'all can stick around and chat. And uh, yeah, otherwise, I hope everybody has fun. I'm uh, dip now. See you. Yes, players, take, see take care. Thank y'all for playing. We'll for see y'all soon. Encourage people to lie. I'm sorry I lied to you.